live from inside Rudolph's bright red butthole flaps. It's the Grandma's Virginity Podcast, episode 23. On this week's show, things heat up as the sexual tension between Ryan and Jackie reaches a boiling point. Sorry, no, but Ryan, we are not going to get together. What? It's not going to happen. The wacky meter explodes when Justin meets Tom Green. I got to get the fuck out of here. I got to get the fuck out of here, like panicking. I need to fucking leave. I need to fucking leave right now. And Toppy the Topic finds his soulmate. Toppy I oh. him from old mate. Oh. He's rubbing himself. Keep going. Plus, listener email, Kent's Closet, and much, much, much of that more. Here we go. Uh, all right, everybody. Welcome to episode number 23 of the Grandma's Virginity Podcast. <laughs> I'm Justin Roiland. With me is Ryan Ridley. Hello. And back in her seat is Jackie back Buscarino. Back from the grave. <laughs> <laughs> 23. I thought this was 22. No, we did 22 with Aubrey. La- that was last week. Oh, oh, so, okay, so but I get it. So so you did do an episode. Yeah. yeah. And it's posted. No. Up? Well, well, it will yes. be by now. Yes. Yeah. Because this one's the one after. And, and in the effort of full transparency, let's just fucking say that we're recording this. Uh, it's you know, it's Merry Christmas, to you guys. <laughs> but but this has been pre-recorded. But Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas. I hope ho, Santa ho, comes ho. tonight and has all your stocking stuffed with <laughs> gifts. But um, the Christmas show. But to, but in reality, it's actually we're recording this. Uh, you know, a can little I, bit earlier than that. Can I say how? How happy I am to see Jackie back. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Shut up. Me Jackie, too. I realized something the more I'm getting to know you because we've actually been talking and we spent time together once mm-hmm, outside mm-hmm. of this. You're uncomfortable taking compliments. Or you're uncomfortable oh, taking yeah. like when someone says like something oh, like like when I say how important you are to the podcast. Yeah. Because I've realized <laughs> that with Abed it was not the same at all. You're uh-huh. like, oh, it's t- it was fine. It was fine. Yeah. And, and, and if this – and this is also to anyone who's listening – I'm not saying all of you feel this way, but I <laughs> guarantee the majority of people feel the same. And let her know that by bombarding her Facebook page. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there'll be like three people. Or her email or her phone, I guess. I'll give but that I out. Do her love phone number is 818. Some yeah. people have written me on Facebook with their personal problems, and I love that. I love that type of thing. Why I won't say any- who. I won't say who. Why doesn't like, anyone come to me? Girl trouble, boy trouble. Do you give them advice? What yeah. are you, fucking Ann a- 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 Landers? Yes. That sounds yeah. pretty radical. I must be. Yeah, un- I love it. I, I'm either. I'm either. I'm either unapproachable, or I'm just unappealing because no, nobody because ever I'm comes to me. I'm a girl. What 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 boy is going to come with you? Come to you with trouble? What 15 year old boy is going to talk Ryan, to you? Ryan, I um, I, my my I my, really relate my, with you. My pappy touched my pee pee. <laughs> See, that's why they don't write. My pappy touched my pee pee. Ryan, <laughs> I need help. What do I do? Signed, Jonathan. Uh, gosh, Jonathan, um, that is a tough one, uh, but you came to the right person. You have person. to ask, is your pappy attractive? <laughs> Does he have big, thick, muscular, hairy, manly arms? Did he touch your pee-pee until completion? Where his hand, are, his hand, are each of his fingers like giant sausages? Manly, muscular, meaty fingers? Um, all right, well, so we're back together again, thank God. Yeah. Uh, not that Abed, you know, not to insult Abed, but... I'm sure everyone's thinking the same thing I am, <laughs> and that is. Has anybody commented on that? No, well, no one's yet. heard it yet. Oh yeah, you already. That's told another me that. transparency I thing we have to confess. For some reason, I will say this uh, uh, vacation I took, I have complete memory loss. Um, like you know, how Justin's like, I can't remember shit. Blah blah blah. And I c- I usually can remember everything. I can't remember anything. I have to ask people two to three times what they've just said. Have you been taking Ambien? Should I? Yeah, it's kind of cool. <laughs> Helps you sleep, makes you hallucinate. Um, no, now I sleep. I sleep too much. I you cannot know what it is? get ja- up Jackie, in the morning. I'll tell you what that is. It's, oh, depression. Yes. <laughs> yep, yeah, I'm right are, there with you, sister. Those are the telltale signs of depression. Uh, no, uh, uh, lack of being of able to focus on people. Yeah. Like bad memory because you're distracted big time. I feel and like sleeping. I'm in a fog. Yeah. I feel like the walls are closing in on me. Yes. Oh, I feel... Awesome. <laughs> I, feel, I feel great. I just want yeah. something good to happen. That's all. I mean, it could be anything. 
Finding twenty dollars. You know in the what street, I realized? I'd be Finding really Nemo. happy. <laughs> remember, remember. I, I, I don't think we talked on this podcast, but Justin and I went out to dinner a couple weeks ago, and we just got in this job, which we've talked about before. Yeah. Uh, last week, let me let me clarify something. It's a little confusing our t- our references to to why no one's heard the last episode yet because we're recording this the same week we recorded the previous episode, but it hasn't come up yet. This is like the trying to, show sketch. Trying to bang out a couple of episodes so, before so the holidays. We're recording. We're recording this while the twenty. 20- Third episode, while the twenty second episode has not yet gone live. So yeah. anyway, so they'll both wrap go live. Little heads around that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So the point I'm making is that uh, what the fuck was I talking about? What was I talking uh, about? I don't know. Memory loss. I'm depressed. Oh yeah, that. Walls, You're miserable. Walls closing, walls closing in. in on me. Oh, me and Justin went out the to job. dinner a few weeks ago. Oh, the that's job. Right. And we got in this job, which was like, believe me, I needed that because the yeah. Blue Mountain State money was running out. Because I'm thinking I'm starting to learn that I am reckless with my spending habits. Oh, and so we who got, isn't in this crazy town? <laughs> and we got this new job all of a sudden out of nowhere. And at the same time, Justin and I were both dating people. And it was right. going great. We're going on double dates together. Yeah, you know, yeah. Universal I, Studios. Yeah, Universal Studios Horror Nights. Oh, God. Horror. What are... Yeah. W H O R E. <laughs> I mean, it really was. On t- I was on top of the world for the first time in a yeah. long time. And I'm sitting there. Me and Justin go to a nice sushi dinner together. And I'd say to Justin... You know what, man? I'm just filled with this feeling of like everything's going great, and it's just you got to really appreciate it. We both we got this job. Well, specifically, we both, you said this moment in time. Yeah, this right moment now. in time, right now. Aww. Yeah, and it could all be gone tomorrow. But of but course, right I, I didn't really believe it could all be gone tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> and then it happened, <laughs> and then it all went, it all went away tomorrow, the next day. Did yeah. it really? Was no, it, the it was next like, day, a, but it was within, like within within a week or two, the girl left know. me. The job <laughs> got a little... Let's turn into a yeah, nightmare. The, 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 the job... But listen, I always sort of had <laughs> that kind of... You know what I mean? Mm. I was sort of expecting... You were love you babies in it up when you first got it. N- no, that's not true. I mean, listen, mm. I was... That's Jackie's shorthand for going Hollywood, for being <clears throat> yeah, Hollywood. Love yeah, love you babes. Uh, now, you're you babes. right in the sense that I was like, guess who I'm working with? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I always, always, always had a level head about... The road that this thing was eventually going to. I know take. you can't say what it is you're working on, but I do want to know something very important. Yeah. What? Are you going to get tickets? Oh, uh, may I don't know. Maybe I can. We can find out. I, 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 I better be on that guest list. You will be. Believe me, Jackie. I. If there's one thing I want to do, it's make you happy. <laughs> Shut up. I, yeah. You know, I, why don't you believe that? I'm feeling empathy towards you because you know we're both depressed. Yeah, yeah. You know, I did have fun uh, <laughs> last night. I think it was. Uh-huh. I oh. was at the Cartoon Network Christmas party and I was dancing. And for like 40 minutes, I forgot yeah. that I'm fucking all... old, <laughs> dumped, poor. Yeah, but all those like animation guys ugly. just drooling over you. No, God, no. You're no one that, you... cares. No one cares. I think there's something wrong Smurfette? with me. You're not Jackie, you... There's something wrong this with me. This goes back to your inability to no. take compliments. No, no, no. You, you are no. just... Your blinders are up and you're That's just like, true. I'm an old... Yeah, yeah shit, Jackie, nobody... when I walked in tonight, you turned and I was like, oh, Jackie looks really attractive. Oh, Wait a minute. Up. I swear to God, oh, I thought that. I swear. Up. Hey, you know what I just realized? God. Ryan's single and heartbroken. Jackie's single and heartbroken. I know. I saw... I read some of the comments i mean yeah on, um, I, I mean come well, on you it doesn't take about- a genius <laughs> to put those two pieces together no well because jackie in that video that i posted of our phone conversation yeah. you said you know ryan you lately you're pretty, pretty terrific. terrific i meant it what did you mean by that well because we were getting along you were being nice and that uh, with, and our, I was, with like, our common well, enemy and then, no no <laughs> not even that i was like oh ryan is normal like he can talk normal what and, did you like, think he, I thought. I guess I thought you were a little bit more like Justin, just more like in your own world. Not. Please don't have a cow, Justin. I'm not. Relax. Don't have a cow, be man. Be like, you know, wrapped up in yourself. Oh, and I am I was pretty like, wrapped oh. up, but wrapped up in your pain. Wrapped up in a douche, so to speak. Like a yeah. Yeah. Um. You know what? Uh. I just. Wanna... Sorry, no, but Ryan, we are not gonna get together. What? Oh. It's not gonna happen. Why? Oh. Um. A number of reasons. Let's Come on. list them. Number one. Right. Um, number ten. We'll go back. Yeah, we'll go. It'll be like the top Letterman. ten reasons why <laughs> Jackie won't be um, with Ryan. Number ten. <laughs> <laughs> He's Jewish. Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh, that's, that would be that's number, number one. one. Yeah. All right. That's no, number no, one. Okay. Number one. No, no, no. Let's call it number ten. No, it's number nine. I can't even just come on. Think of brainstorm. You, uh, either of you that way. Mm-hmm. I just cannot. 
I well, spent too much no time with you, no and one's I asking, feel no one's like asking you to think shut that up. Way about I just me. feel like I'm your big sister or something big like sister. that. Big sister, yeah, big fat sister. <laughs> you're younger than me. Yeah, you're younger than Ryan. Yeah. But so. oh, I still you feel, feel that like way. you're more mature than me. N- yeah. <laughs> um, have you I, come around to my looks at all? No. <laughs> hey, I was talking about myself at the Christmas party. <laughs> okay, go on. Oh yeah, you're forty no, minutes No, I was of saying place. I think that there's something wrong with me. Like, I mean, there was like. One boy that I was like, oh, he's he's so cute, and uh-huh. I like trying to talk to him, and I'm I'm I, there's something wrong with me. I don't know why. What, what do you is. mean? You I don't know. I just happened. can't. I don't know what it is, but I just feel like I'm. I can't explain it. I don't. Do you know. you think he was attracted to you? Do you think he's interested? Was there no. Some... Why not? No. How did you meet? Well, did you even talk to the guy? Um. Yeah, a little bit. I bet if you I... went up to him and you just like looked at him and then you whispered in his ear and said, "I want to suck your cock." <laughs> Do you think that would work? Yeah, I bet it would work. Okay, I'm going to try it. <laughs> I'm sure he'd consider it. Yeah, he'd, Gross. He'd, I mean, if anything, he'd feel really good about himself. <laughs> I just tell my listeners out there, if you know anyone who's rich and very handsome. <laughs> what about muscly? Muscles has to be in shape. Uh-huh. Muscles. She, she, yeah. I'm shallow. Likes uh, farts and poops. Likes farts in World War II, Vietnam. <laughs> hey, Facebook me. Yeah. If you had to only pick like three out of those five or two out of the three or whatever, what are the what are the most important things? Like what? F- liking fart or poop humor, being super handsome, being super rich. Yeah. W- World War Two. What's whatever the, the most fuck important? Oh, and I'd have to pick only three. Yeah, yeah. You can only pick three. <laughs> <laughs> And being um, heterosexual. Yeah. Oh, right, right, right. Um, I guess handsome. Uh-huh. Do, is muscles part of handsome? Yeah. Okay. okay. No. No, because I'm That's handsome, but I'm in. not muscly. That's handsome. <laughs> right? <coughs> right, Jackie? Yeah. Uh, well, sure. Whatever, Ryan. Um, <laughs> handsome in shape. I'm not talking about, like, you know, you don't have to be, like, crazy. You know, I know but... where she needs to go. Huh? Go to f- get, is, fucking make a friend on uh, Camp Pendleton in, in San Diego. <laughs> And then just go there and hang out on the fucking and get yeah. raped. <laughs> no, but I mean, you'll be surrounded by exactly what you're what you want. You're describing Jackie. You can be you the center of a military scandal. <laughs> but I mean, getting raped and they Kent don't Pendleton. like like when you when I think about that, like they, military guys, they, like they're all no, the same. they're not. Yeah. Not, they're a not gonna one. like the same things that I like. They're like. Yeah, but that doesn't You matter. like World War II. You, you, when you're, you're at your house, you've got all this war fucking shit yeah, everywhere. Now, oh, yeah. Now you're asking too much. Now you want them to like all the same things. You you want a clone yeah, of you? Yeah, I want... Yes, yeah. No, that's I not I always what you thought want. that I would make a really cute boy. <laughs> oh. Do you think so? Well, maybe well let's you get you do, into Have you seen Boys Don't Cry? Yeah. Maybe you should do that. Well, that... No, a lot of people said I look like Hillary Swank in Boys I Don't Cry. I can see that, yeah. Yeah, and I thought, man, that's pretty good. Could you ever go lesbian? No. You sure? No. Even if she was I'm, really manly ripped, like ew, shits and farts. no, no, but I mean, <laughs> if the girl... Hey, check out, my, check out my poop, Yeah, Jackie. If the girl was really pretty, then maybe I would let her, like, tickle my yeah. arm. Oh. Ew, no! <laughs> tickle my arm. And by arm, And my hair. Mean... And my by hair. By hair, like you this. mean your mom's pubis? Yeah, no. Yeah. Oh. No. No. Which, by the way, your grosso roommate <laughs> wrote something Whoa. nasty on... on um, Come he on, said something now. about code for... Oh, because when you asked me to come over... Because I cut, and you notice I didn't keep in the edit the part where you invited me over to smoke and drink. Oh, yeah, I'm glad you cut that out. <laughs> well, now everyone hears it here. And so that even made it more scandalous. But when you said, oh, you can come over and help me paint yeah. and yeah, sand yeah. and yeah. whatever, he did a little joke where he made those all be sexual metaphors. Yeah, I know. Well, that oh. is disgusting. That's pretty good. I like that. Good for yeah. you, Dan. I like the fa- I mean, if you guys are listening right now, if you're one of the... 2,500 people that's not that listens to the show but isn't part of the Facebook page. Well, you're really missing out because there, there's, there's a lot of great stuff going on. There's a lot of great stuff. For example, let me, let, me, let me just take a look at a post. But also, here. really quick, uh, download the iPhone app. Oh my gosh. And you know what else we didn't talk about is I broke my finger. Oh, tell us, please. Uh, maybe I can put the x rays up. Oh. That's all. I just Wait, I broke when? my finger. How? Uh, I dropped a boulder on it. 
A boulder. A what? boulder. I was trying what to move a boulder. What the fuck are you doing boulder. with boulders? Well, it had been sitting in my yard for a long time, and just someone wouldn't help me throw it away. Checking it out every day. Oh, so there's I that threw, boulder. I tried to throw it away, and I, I smashed my finger. Like, I permanently smashed my finger. I don't finger. understand. You lifted the boulder up and no, then dropped it? No, it was too it? heavy, but I was trying to roll it down the stairs, and it got un- out of control, and I was all, oh, shit. A boulder got out of control being rolled down the stairs? Yes. Yeah. yeah, and it and just went boom. On your finger. And my finger went as flat as, like, a cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> like, I... I was like, what I, finger? I, I, this one. It didn't see? swell up. Oh my up. god! Did you, Let me see. Did you it was the... way worse when you saw it. Oh. It was. Jackie, it, did yeah. you go to the yeah. Yeah. hospital? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god. Um, but I never saw something on my body get as flat as a pancake before. Hmm. It got as finger. flat as a pancake. And my wiener. <laughs> yeah. Yes, and it was crazy. Lips. Yes, and I was like this. <gasps> uh oh! <gasps> and then I <gasps> immediately thought I was gonna pass out. Did you cry? No, I just was like. I'm gonna faint. I'm gonna, fa- I'm gonna faint. I'm gonna faint. And so I got inside and then laid down because I was like, okay. it was so sick. I, I just because I, I, I feel like we have unfinished business here with oh, you, sorry. Jackie, and I want to, because the last episode we, one of the segments we did was we all talked about how we lost our virginity. Ew. And, yeah, yeah. And we were all very honest and open. Abed, Ryan, and I told the stories, the stories of how we all lost our virginity, and you know it was a great topic, but it sort of. You know, we we, we kept lacking. thinking, like, ah, oh, man, I wish Jackie was here because oh, we all I really wanted have shared. to. What? That's private. Jackie, Why? Come on. I wouldn't. I would never. I'm a virgin. Jackie, I am. How did you lose your virginity? Who was it with? What happened? Was it horrible? Was it was it wonderful? Was it magical? Was it was it? Will you answer yes or I no? Will never talk about. Are you like serious? That. Yeah, Get up I'm to never. The I'll talk really? about poop and pee, but I would never give you anything on that. You would wow. never. No. Wow. Especially not on a podcast. That's crazy. Would you well, ever? Would you... you never talk about your sex life at all. No. Would you ever talk about like the worst sex you had, the best sex you had? Never. I don't even know what that means. Jackie, our listeners need to hear this. The young girls in the audience. No, that's what I'm saying. Tell the young girls in the audience, don't do it. Look, that's a, that's that's like the Catholics, uh, yeah. like saying, you know, yeah. Condoms are the devil. We can go round and round, but you won't get anything out of me. All right. Well, Man. I gave it a shot. Yeah. Can we, yeah, we, can we start like a board so we know what the, Jack, Jackie will never talk about? Well, I guess it's I, a yeah. good thing. I guess it's a good thing we did that segment w- without w- she wasn't here. Yeah. Yeah. And the truth is, and I don't really care about other people's stories about that either. Hmm, I think well, Jackie had a bad experience. <laughs> well, it was either rape or you know, or something. Oh. 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 Gang rape. Oh. Um, can I read something? Yeah. Oh, so great. on the Facebook page, this is why I like the uh, Facebook page a lot. This guy puts, we had not done a show before the last episode uh, for almost a month, I believe. Uh-huh. And just, you know, by the way, that we're, we're, we're insane people. I'm the most sane. <coughs> and yeah, you right. hear what I, you know, me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. <coughs> you be the judge audience. Well, you, oh, wait a minute, Jackie. You don't think that I'm the most sane? I was the most sane, I think. Uh, I wasn't. But we can I all was. agree that Justin is. He doesn't even. Hey, I'm I'm fucking crazy, but believe me, it, it pays the bills. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be I wouldn't be in this town doing what I do if I wasn't. We, I know I that. I know that. I've you know I'm not saying. But it's I'm a actually bad thing. I'm, I'm not. I, I mean I'm 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 not. You know I mean I'm crazy, but don't get the wrong idea. I'm not like. Uh, There's I, all I don't, different kinds of yeah, crazy. In I don't the world. need a padded cell. I'm just the kind of mind that might make a cartoon with a guy. Eating his mother's shit. <laughs> that, I'm that kind of crazy. Okay, so um, so uh, crazy like a fox cartoon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's never gonna happen. All right, but something better will happen. Yeah. Okay. What's it sounded happening? like it could have been critical, but it wasn't. I have no idea what he. I know. What he's is, talking this, about. is this about the Facebook? Yeah. Page? You're, is that? A quote? I'm about to get to that. Mm. Um. So uh, uh, this guy named Seth posts on the Facebook page. Uh huh. After our abs- long extended absence, my five stages of Grandma's Virginity podcast grief. Uh oh. Number one, denial. <laughs> They're going to post the new show any minute. I just know it. Check's website. This behavior is repeated almost constantly Friday through Sunday. First of all, that feels good. Can you believe that people actually give that much of a shit? Yeah, it's cool. That's sweet. I mean, it's it's also it also makes me feel guilty when we don't have an episode. Yeah, I'm coming. We really now have created some sort of bond or or something where I feel bad. I feel really bad. Yeah. I mean, you know, it just I never thought anyone would give that much of a shit. Yeah, baby. So <laughs> denial is where I'm at, uh, or at least I was at with my breakup. I'm just like interesting to kind of compare this with the girl that that uh, that I broke up with. The denial. Oh, she's she's gonna we're gonna get back together. 
Yeah. This isn't going to yeah. stick, okay? So now okay. anger is what he writes next. Why the heck can't keep, can't they keep the episodes coming on time? How else am I supposed to keep make how how else am I supposed to make strangers on my way to work think I'm loony if I can't laugh to myself for Mr. Scoops or Mario? Mm-hmm. If they can't get it together and dropping this podcast that, with the girl, same thing. Mm-hmm. I'm like angry. Mm-hmm. What the fuck is mm-hmm. wrong with her? Mm-hmm. Fuck yeah. her. Yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. this is amazing. Bargaining. Just let them post the new episode this week, and it'll be okay. I didn't actually want to stop listening. I didn't mean that. I'm sure they have a lot going on, but if they just updated us on the status of the new episodes, I could forget that. This? Who is this again? This guy named Seth. I love him. Yeah, it's awesome. Once again, same thing. I'm like, I can talk to this girl. Mm-hmm. We'll figure mm-hmm. it out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, please. Just come on. I can like, forgive them. Bargaining, yeah. Depression. <laughs> I've listened to all the episodes, even leftover specials and the Ferris wheel update seven times now while waiting for the new episode. <laughs> it all sounds the same to me. What's the point in a new episode anyway? <laughs> oh, oh, man. Depression. Yeah. No, that sounds like a depressed yeah, thought. Yeah. That's sure. where I'm at. Depression and acceptance. Yeah. Acceptance. When they're ready, they will post it. I'm fine. Fo- and, and then you focus on something else. I'm like, sure they oh. have very good reasons for the delay. Oh, a new video game came out. I'll I'm just- a loyal fan and I will stand by them during the tough spot. I understand that the real world often gets in the way. <laughs> it, this has honestly been the craziest, like, roller coaster, uh, perfect storm the, situation that has caused us to be this behind on the show. Well, and I, also the holidays are obviously yeah. hard. And, 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 and also after this episode, there's going to be another at least week break because Justin's going to be out of town for two yeah, weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, so this that's is why the you're last... cramming in another yeah. two episodes this in This is the last week. episode of the Weren't new year. Were we supposed to have guests too? <clears throat> Look, but peep, you know, it didn't work out. And guess what? This is the first episode because last week we didn't have you mm-hmm, and we had mm-hmm. the interview with Justin's parents that we're using last week. This week, just us three. It's all we got. The old right. days. Okay, yep. let's stop let's talking see about vintage. Can we actually just like oh, do a show? Do a show now. Vintage GVP. For fuck's sake. Um. All right, everybody. Uh. <clears throat> happy Christmas, huh? Let's. <laughs> I'm going to talk about Christmas real yeah. quick. Yeah. I've got uh. I've got my gifts for Jackie and Ryan. Whoa. I got. Oh. I got you guys Christmas gifts. Wow. And we're gonna do it on the show. I. So, oh Merry my Christmas, god! Everyone. You really did. I hope it's something dumb. That makes me feel bad. Why? Because you All didn't right. do anything? I, so, didn't, I haven't done any Christmas Of course shopping. you guys I'm Jewish, didn't. so. All right. So I'll give Ryan's wow. first. Ooh. Ryan, what do you think it is, Ryan? Oh. I can't tell. Wait, let's make Ryan guess maybe for well, a Can bit. I hold it and stuff? Alcohol. It's alcohol. Well, it's, it's a small package. Yeah. It's like a small rectangular Ryan, package. Ryan, you'll never about... guess in a million fucking years First of all, I got to say, Justin, you, you really got us presents. And he wrapped them up And this really wasn't even like a gimmick. Nice. Yeah, he wrapped them up nice. There's cards and ribbons. Fancy wrapping paper, and this have, isn't a bit for the show. This is the first year that I that I've you just happen to be giving us presents on I, the well, show. Well, this is but. the first year that I that I haven't been employed during Christmas and bu- like fucking uh, you know busy, and also that I had just money that I could burn. Throw. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so that means this gift's gonna be really expensive. <laughs> oh, maybe. But I'm shaking. Can it. I see, feel the weight of it? Yeah. Sometimes I'm it's good light. at guessing. It's light. Also, I think I have. Walking oh, is it pneumonia. a bobblehead? No. <laughs> oh, um, not a bobblehead. Is it a gag gift, Justin, or is it an, a serious gift? You think it's something I'm going to like? I think it's a hybrid gag slash serious gift. Really? It's, it's I'm no, you know, for. it's not a gag gift. It, this, this, this is something. God. Oh, oh, uh, an electronic device thing, it's like yes. something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah. like, oh um, um. Wait it's a, a minute. It's an electronic device. Is it a flip phone? No. No. That's too expensive. A f- you mean a flip video recorder? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I talked about how I need it's it. similar, but it's not. Yeah. Is it an audio recorder? Mm, yes, it, it, it does have that capability. Is it an iPhone? <laughs> open on. it, open it, open it. How much open money it, do you think it. I'm going to spend on you? Ryan? <laughs> open it. <laughs> okay. All right, he's going to open right. it now. God, everyone. I'm, I'm already feeling so. This, what is it? It's going to be like, so good. It's going to be like, what the fuck is this? Hold on, I can't. It's, it's very confusing. It's yeah, a dark I, box. The wrapping paper oh, is what rubber. What the fuck? <laughs> it's sunglasses? Well, look closely. Is this something from the spy shop? Yeah. Oh what is it? Oh my god! Rich. POV action video camera, digital video camera sunglasses. Yeah. What, what do you do with that? Okay. No fucking way. Yeah. So those glasses, and they're some of the best ones you can get. No way. In, the, in that price bracket, without yeah. going crazy, uh, they record they record um, VGA quality video of what you see and audio. And there's a little button. No on that's the thing. fucking way. Rad. And it records. It has a four gig <laughs> built in four gig hard drive or memory, and then you can expand it to a total of eight gigs. And uh, and it's badass because you just hit a button and it records directly into the sunglasses and then you hook it up to your computer <laughs> and you can download is. the Are you videos. Serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can yeah. just go out in public and just fucking yeah, just whatever you want. 
Yeah, that's and I think good. it's wide angle too, so it like. But it's so obvious. That this is <laughs> look at these well, things. Well, <laughs> I don't know. I haven't opened them up, but you I gotta feel try like. Oh, I'm just here. Yeah, to have yeah. A meeting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's like a big <laughs> camera in the middle. Yeah. Of your... No, I feel like it's open very the box. I want to see what they look like. Okay, I how, feel Justin. Like... How much did you did you spend more on me and my present than Jack? I hope so. Yeah, I did actually. I mean, because you guys you know are why? besties. Because you because because th- you're you're also sort of like thinking this is also sort of you could use it too in a way like well yeah I fi- well here you could the, use the way the I show, you know what I mean the way I sh- the way I picked something out for you Ryan was mm-hmm. was looking for something that I thought would yeah. I would want yeah, yeah you yeah. know what I mean because it's like I, I I don't know how to. Uh, you know, any other way, I wouldn't know how to fucking find something. God, this is amazing, Justin. I want to see, like, <laughs> how good of sunglasses they look. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. If... Let's take a look at these. And we'll post a picture of them on the God, Facebook. I'm going to do, the so, I'm gonna do I'm gonna so small. much hijinks. Yeah. I wish I wore my contacts. D- dude. Whoa. The, you... They oh, just wow. look like regular sunglasses. Yeah, no, they look cool as cool as I thought they would. It, it, you can post videos on the Facebook page with that. <laughs> so, look at these. Look at the, the sides. But still, that's, yeah, yeah, you yeah, can't yeah. It, put them on. Yeah, the sides are a little out of control, but but you wouldn't know that if they look. No, on, dude, you they just can't. Look normal. You really? cannot tell. There's a fucking no. camera built. Really? In. Yeah, there's yeah. no. That is crazy. Yeah. Turn this way. No, you know, honestly, Ryan, they just look like fucking designer. Or no, weird they, to sunglasses. me, they look like uh, like an athlete's sunglasses. Oh yeah, my yeah, God. yeah, yeah. Nobody's gonna fucking know because the, the, they're not. That's not in the the public like. The the public awareness level on those kind of things are, are really? is very low. I think. Yeah. What can I do with these, Justin? Give me some ideas. You could fucking secretly record. When you come back hates. over to my house, uh huh. You can do that. Or when we view. begin our affair. Oh. <laughs> All right, now Jackie, here I got you something. It's a book. Nope. Is it a book on World War II? It's a book. Is Open it, it. Is it a book on World Maybe. War II? <laughs> Vietnam. Maybe. It's got to be World War II. Vietnam. I, I I wouldn't be surprised if you already have this, wow, but we'll Justin see. Justin drew a picture on mine too. Oh, he didn't draw a picture on mine. Yeah, did. you Jackie. just didn't look, or maybe I did. To Jackie, I love you so much. What? Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, Why didn't you say that to me? Why don't you write that on mine? I don't think I wrote weird. that. Justin, I think she's making things up, but no, maybe I, I did. <laughs> All right. I was uh, on I guess- acid when I wrapped these, so <laughs> oh, I don't remember. I, I guess scene. that I'm getting a book about World War II, and I really <sighs> hope I am. <clears throat> Oh, is this the um? Oh, oh, oh! Wait, I may. I think I already have this. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking wait, knew wait, it with the different cover. Um, I knew it. I figured you probably did. She's got two copies of it, and I'm so pissed. Can I yeah, just tell you? Yeah, you know, well, no, that'll I be your two second copies. copy. Yeah, yeah. yeah Jackie, I don't want when I visited her house, it. she she's got two <laughs> copies of like a lot of these books yeah. that she has in her bookshelf. And you know why? <laughs> why? Because of her dark little heart. She says when she sees a book in a bookstore, she really likes. She'll buy the other copy if there's like another copy to use bookstore, so that no one else can have that book. <laughs> what? Just to make sure that no one else. So she had like multiple copies of all these different. Weird. Books. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what sucks about this is oh. they had it new. And then I saw a collectible co- quality copy, and I'm like, to it's me, it's okay to say you bought a used book. No, I. But here's the thing: to me, when I see the word collectible, because I'm a collector, that means it's in mint fucking condition. Like it's the highest level of quality. It's better than new. It's like collectible. It's fucking collectible. So guys, I buy this thing. You guys want to lose your lunch? Let me show you some pictures. And it shows up in just the shittiest condition I've ever seen a book, and I was so. You have to order this. In a yeah, concentration yeah, yeah, yeah. camp, what are you going to show Walk us? Out. Yeah, look at their performing experiments. All right, I don't want to see it. <sighs> I knew it exactly what page to turn My to. My people. Put it away. This is crazy shit. Put it Have away. Have you guys seen the picture of the guy dying on the barbed wire? No, put the fucking thing away. I will not put it away don't now. Don't make me regret buying you that for Christmas. <laughs> this is great. This whole you person's mouth freak. has been cut open. because they're doing. Hey, everybody, what what'd you guys get for Christmas? Here's people Why going in. Just the get her showers? a big book of Holocaust. I should have coffee table photo stop book. Stop it. I should have just got her like a fucking KKK. You like, book. just stop it right um, there. This who, is great. I know. So, you know what? This is great. Wh- wh- it is. So where is where, where, where are my I presents it. at, guys? What about oh, now? I my turn. <laughs> my turn. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to open them. I can't wait to see what you guys got me. What thought? Oh. All right, Jackie. Jackie, you ready to give Justin his present? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay. It's live sex show. Oh, yeah. All right. What? Ryan and Jackie, you guys live, are going to have sex for me show. right here in front. Oh, in front come on! All right. All right. Oh, yeah. It's, it, it's time for, for another Kent's episode of Kent's Closet. Closet. Hey, 
everybody. Hey. Most interesting man <laughs> on the podcast. Can't Isn't that for Dos Equis, man? That's why he's the most interesting mm. man on the podcast, not on on Earth or the yeah. world or whatever. Uh, and by the way, that Wait. guy is not real, and he's not very interesting. <laughs> Just so you know, it's a marketing thing. I like yeah, those commercials. He's, well, yeah, because He was invented that's your, in a room. Admit it. You find him attractive. Yeah. Yes. Is he rich? He is now. <laughs> yeah, he's probably made at least enough money to buy it, like a modest home. See, Which the ironic thing is that the, the actual Ken, actor- do you know him? Are the we talking about man? me? No. Who are you, no, talking, who are you talking about? Like oh, 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 I don't. No. The, the old man would just have the actor would only have stories about how you know one day I was on the set of a commercial. <laughs> that I was actually, yeah. 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 You want the actual character? Yeah. 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 He doesn't. He would exist. tell stories about his character. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. The director. But I have actual stories. Like yeah. I. I was yeah. Kent's lived. You've got real stories. Not Kent's like that bullshit. Travel the earth, the globe. Where have you been, Kent? Uh, I've been everywhere. Seriously? Uh, everywhere but Antarctica. You've been okay. to every continent. And Australia. Then you must have... Why don't have we have you been crazy... to Africa? I've been travel to the airport story. in Cairo. <laughs> why, have you, why don't you have crazy travel stories? When I yeah. said I've been everywhere, I... <laughs> been perhaps seven. I overstated <laughs> that. Uh, no, I've been to like 25 countries. I don't know. I'm, wow. I'm, I think I'm well-traveled. So you probably do have some travel stories. Sure. Yeah. Oh, my God. All right, well, we might have to add that. So Maybe we should take out wheel. Schneider stories and replace it with... Well... How is, there about, another, is there an S word we can say for travel? Okay, I'll add um, that in. How about okay. that? All right, so uh, Kent is a, a well-accomplished person. We've already established that. Uh, he's a storyboard animation writer. Animation um, legend, mumblecore superstar, etc., uh, etc. TV, uh, basic cable host. TV movie host. School um, time. <laughs> check previous episodes <laughs> for kind. who yeah. he is. D- dig up an earlier 31st episode. 31st build star of, of the yeah. 1992. Or Google. Can, can we put School an house? album on Facebook just so people can... Yeah. It would be a Ken Osborne. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Okay. Like a still from... Yeah. I'll give you some choice picks from okay. over the years. Um, all right. So we have a giant wheel here. Just and pictures of me hanging I'm going to spin it and whatever it's wedge... Gotten, I've, I've noticed you've gotten it re- refurbished. Yeah. I had it polished and uh, I painted You know, I, I painted it. So it's a lot col- more colorful now. And there's got pictures some, on it. And yeah. I put some gloss to lock in the, the, the acrylic paint. There's so a picture of, um, <laughs> of Rob Schneider's face for Schneider's yeah, face. Yeah. Yeah. I put Stamos Stamos. Face. yeah uh, I sort of, wow, I'm not we sure. don't even need words anymore. Now, who is, this is that? Right. What is that for sex stories? I'm not exactly. Oh, uh, well, it's it's a uh, 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 <laughs> oh, but it's it. not the famous one. It's it's a different one. I found. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's a, even it's though it's even a deep though... cut, it's a goatsy deep cut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 the blooming onion, the prolapsed Ew, anus. Oh God! All right. <laughs> yummy, okay. Yummy. <laughs> so here we go. I'm gonna spin the wheel here. Oh, oh look at that! Oh, 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 so shit. fast. Oh, God. Nice and greased up. Oh, oh. Yeah. oh, it's slowing down. It's slowing down. Oh. Tick, 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 tick. Oh, 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 oh. It's stopping. Oh, oh it's a potluck. Oh. Oh. oh, my God. That could be anything. This is the first potluck. By the very, wow. yeah. By its very nature, potluck is anything. Very good. So, who knows? Yeah, yeah. This All is right. good. This is getting good. Okay. The year was uh, 1999. Okay. Pre-millennium. Yes. Got it was it. a different time, really. Yeah, it really Pre-9/11. was. Pre-9-11. Yeah. They're going to make TV shows about it set in that era soon. Yeah. Bill Clinton was Period president. Piece. Yes. Yep. Phantom um, Menace was in the It'll be theaters. like Wonder Years. <laughs> That's right. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, my friend John Stamos. <laughs> oh, God. Ken. Was actually <laughs> out of town. He's supposed to be friends friends with John He was out of town. He was out of town. Okay. <laughs> I'm just setting the stage. Okay. I'm trying to- So he said, you can watch my place. This is called good storytelling. Uh, no, yeah. I was at my apartment in North uh-huh. Hollywood. Nothing to do with John Stamos. Right. He, he is, he's not going to be in this story. Oh. Okay. So people that are Just, annoyed with me name-dropping John Stamos, you should be happy. Well, I yeah. thought you were saying, like, you were giving a heads up, like, just in case you think he right. might be in the story. No. He was out of town. He was out, he was out of town and worked. Got it. Okay. okay. So I was at home, and um, uh, I was uh, writing. I was trying to write, and uh, it was, like, 2 in the afternoon, and, uh, and, I, and I was like, ah, fuck it. I can't write. So I, I'm going to get high. And then I was like, oh, uh, wait, uh, marijuana. Okay. Which was uh, illegal at the time, but now it's legal. Well, yeah. More or less. Time, yeah. Not, in, not if that prop doesn't It was a pass. different, different the time. The prop has already passed, Jackie. It's such a joke. This we'll is, talk about that Do you later. understand what date it is right now? It's at least early December. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. There you uh, go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, content. so I was like, fuck it. I don't want to write. Uh, I'm going to get high. And then I was like, wait, before I get high, I should order a pizza. Of course. Uh, Brilliant. And... Um, and I was, you, I've told you this story. Okay. I love this. this so good. I was like, this would be great because I was. This was back. This is like ten years ago or uh, eleven. 11. Years ago. Yeah, and I wasn't. 
um, watching my weight. So I would order Pizza Hut or whatever, Taco Bell, like all the time. Yeah. Um, I wouldn't order Taco Bell. I would go get Eat it myself. There. Right. <laughs> they don't but, have delivery so, yet. Okay. So I was like, okay, I'm going to order Pizza Hut and then I'm going to get off the phone and I'm going like, to do a bong hit and then I'm going to get high. And then right when I'm like really high, the pizza will, will come. Yeah. It'll be great. So I did that. I ordered the pizza and then I got really high. And then I was like sitting in my apartment and then, you know, they said, you know, it'll be there in 30 minutes. And I was like, great. So I was sitting there and like 20 minutes went by and I was feeling really high. And I was like, this is great. This is amazing. I love it when a plan comes together. (laughs) Uh, That's that's how I was. And then uh, 25 minutes went by and I was like, oh my God, wouldn't it be great if it was early? If it was like five minutes early, this would be amazing. And then 30 minutes went by. Okay. Any minute now. 35 minutes went by. And then like 40 minutes went by and I was like, oh, where is it? Buzzkill. Fuckers. And then 45 minutes went by and then I was like starting to get paranoid. I was like, oh my God, they're something's wrong. Like, did I call the wrong number? And then uh, like 50 minutes went by and I was like, oh God, this is like an FBI, like really elaborate sting operation where they're like, <laughs> oh they know God. that people who order are you, see, you pizzas really are, this? yeah, I was like totally starting oh to freak God. out. You sound and I was like, like me. what do I do? What do I do? And like 55 minutes went by and then finally my buzzer went off and I'm, I'm in an apartment and I was like, oh God, thank God. So I went over and this, um, uh, uh, I should have said this before, but my buzzer d- didn't work at the time. So I couldn't really talk to people with the, mm-hmm. bu- I just buzzed them in. So a buzzer went off and I went over and I buzzed the door and then I opened my door. I was on the second floor and the stairs are right there. And so usually you buzz someone in, you open the door and you can hear them coming up the stairs. So I buzzed them in, I opened the door and I don't hear anything. And so I like buzzed again. And now I'm like seriously not hearing the door open. And so I'm like, okay, what's going on? And so I like leaned out into the hallway and also, I'm in my underwear. <laughs> so I leaned out in the hallway, and I was like, hello? And I heard I heard a voice say, I'm in shock. What? I'm in shock. I'm in shock? I've been shot. Oh. I've been shot, Yeah, Ryan. what? I've been shot. Uh-huh. So, and it wasn't, it wasn't the pizza guy. It was someone who had been shot. Oh, and my they, God. And they were, like, bu- like just buzzing Mashing any, any the- buzzer. Yeah, like, and I was like, oh, my God. And I was, like, really high. And I'm, like, walking, oh down, my God. walking down the stairs in my underwear. And I was like, I can't fucking deal with this. I, I can't call the cops. Like, this person's been shot. And I got to the bottom of the stairs, and it, it was the it was the pizza guy <gasps> and he was deaf and he was saying pizza hot <laughs> <laughs> that is my favorite story <laughs> well number one and then I was just like oh god I was like oh thank god why you're, was you're he deaf. so late I don't know I you never asked. I never <laughs> asked he's deaf, <laughs> he's deaf Jackie yeah. please you think I'd have got there at all <laughs> Oh, my God. That's fucking hilarious. Um, well, first of all, that's great. Second of all, your second story in a row that was amazing both dealt with the same device of misunderstood. Yes, <laughs> you're right. Yeah. Yes. But it's amazing what your mind fills in when yeah. you hear yeah. something. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I, I could see in my mind, like, the buzzers, like, uh-huh. with blood on uh-huh. them, like, his hand just hitting yeah. the buzzers and... <laughs> And I was really like, "What am I gonna do?" Oh, oh god! Yeah, what if scared? you had just... What if? What if you were like, "Fuck it, being high isn't that big of a deal. I gotta call the cops." You just call yeah. the cops. <laughs> the cops are showing up. We gotta get. We got a man down. Then you'd really be fucked. Mm. Wow, that was a fantastic uh, uh, rendition. I have of... told that story really good. many a time. So good. Yeah. Woo! Well, that was confusing. That was confusing because I yeah. really thought that was Justin because I wasn't looking at him. I was looking down, and then when I looked at Justin and he wasn't moving his mouth when I heard the scream, I was like really confused for a second. I was like, "What the fuck?" And yeah. then you mimicked him really Ken. good. Yeah. Can you, Can you do more impersonations of him? Yeah, to, uh, I, don't, I don't know. Yeah. He's I wasn't good. even trying. He's good at impersonations do it impression too. Justin, Justin's yeah, do, very do easy. I mean? yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm easy. I don't know if I can. Uh, hey, uh, hey, everybody! Uh, <laughs> welcome to my podcast. <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah, now do good. Ryan. Do Ryan now. Uh, Ryan, uh, <laughs> this is, these are awful. This is like I think it's pretty good. High school uh, talent. Show. Everybody, whenever anyone does an impression of me, it's always like I'm learning that people perceive me as very nasally. Yeah, you're very, very articulate. Uh, <laughs> I can't do it. It's me, Ryan. Do me, do me. Okay. 
Oh, yeah. <laughs> so come, Cute. come fart me. <laughs> what? Oh, come fart, come fart. Yeah. I All know. Right. It was a okay. callback. So it was ago. a callback. All right. Well. All right. Can't wait. All right. Bye, guys. Put Thanks. on a, a, a warm jacket. It's cold outside. Have yeah. a happy holiday. Yeah. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> wait. I think it's we're coming up in the Merry south. Oh my god. Merry Christmas. Yeah, yeah. Merry oh, Christmas. Oh, oh. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll see y'all next time. <laughs> All right, it's time for uh, Jackie's Corner. Jackie's Hi. back. Guess who's back? Hi. Jackie's back. Jackie's back. Back with the lobotomy. <laughs> All right. So, Jackie, what interesting little topic are you going to present to us well, today? I don't know how interesting this is, but it's just a little extra something special that's happening in my life right now, which is already a terrible life. Just a little something to make it a little worse. Terrible life I've is got getting worse. Two <laughs> tickets to in paradise. front of my own home. Parking tickets? Within a matter of a week and a half for not curbing my wheels. Thank you, City of Glendale. For not, like, turning your... You yeah. know what's funny, Jackie? I got a ticket the day I came over your house. What and was I'm... it for? I don't know. I didn't even check it. <laughs> Just, that was the day yeah, my first ticket. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just get this. We'll finish okay, this before okay, we answer okay, the door. Okay. No, 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 no. I want to finish. Okay, here. okay. So I got to look what? at what the ticket says. I just saw it's like for sixty bucks or sixty bucks. Yeah, or something. it's got to be for curbing your wheels. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Let's get this. But where's the ticket? It's in my car. Can we hold look on. at it? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Hold on. Let me get this. Hello. Hey. Hi. It's me. Remember me? No. Refresh uh- my memory. It's me, Toppy the Topic. He's Toppy, Toppy the Topic. Always bringing topics for the show. Whenever there's a lull, Toppy comes around and keeps things from getting way too dull. Oh, Wait a yeah. minute. Hold on. I'm back. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, I got. I, I couldn't help it over here. You guys seem to be real light on Your voice topic. sounds different. It did sound a little different at no, first. Yeah, but I'm, now it's starting to sound familiar. It's the same southern drawl that I've always had. <laughs> I'm, look at me. I'm so tiny you're, and you're blue. The, you're the real. I'm sorry. I haven't seen you in so long. I didn't recognize you. Yeah, no. So I, you're, you're the old. I got some tattoos. <laughs> What's been going on? Did you go to jail? Oh, well, yeah, I did. <laughs> You Poppy, know. what did you do? <laughs> but I got a bunch of topics for you. Okay, because, yeah, we have been sort of struggling for some. I know Justin's concerned. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, got, yeah. I got all kinds of topics. It's, I thought I'd be more excited I, for the return of Toppy, but. What about, let me think here. Uh-huh. Mm, what about if you, maybe why don't you talk about, you ever hear about, you know, when rivers get overflowed and, you know, they flood homes and they take mm-hmm, mm-hmm. take homes down the river? Mm-hmm. Why don't you talk? Maybe you should talk about that. Wow, that is so. I mean, where did it even come from, Toppy? That's a pretty good topic. So, talk about flooding? Yeah. Why? Uh, Talk about, well, you know, yeah. There's a lot of things you could talk about that. Uh, What what do we got? Think about the old people. I I heard about one old lady was trapped (laughs) in a home. She was trapped in a home and got flooded away right down the river. Toppy, how do you come up with your topics? Oh, you know, that's what I do. I'm Toppy the Topic. <laughs> I've got all kinds of topics. Toppy, are you, you know, it's maybe the reason why your voice sounds a little different is because, yeah. are, you, are, you, are you aware of this uh, Disney uh, show called Fish Hooks? No. I, <laughs> so maybe, what's that? Well, I don't know. <laughs> I thought maybe you were concerned that maybe you, your voice yeah, a you bit. sound a little bit too much like no. one of the characters no, on there. No, of course not. This is my regular old <laughs> Toppy voice. You know, I, I I will say I did get my tonsils taken out. Well, maybe that's what it that is. That does change your voice. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, my my wife told me she said <laughs> your wife. when I came home she said who who's that? <laughs> oh, who's home? Even she was fooled. She was in the kitchen making these delicious uh, cookies. They were mint. <laughs> White chocolate cookies. I, we could talk mm. about that recipe. <laughs> yeah, I'd well, love to. Well, it sounds to. like a Christmas recipe. And she it heard is a Christmas me show. Come in and she said, who's, who's What did you that? say? Did you say, honey, I'm home? I said, it's me, Toppy the Topic, your husband. Does she call you Toppy the Topic? Or does she yeah. have like a, like a full? She <laughs> yeah. doesn't say Toppy or Top. 
No, or no. Tea. Well, she calls me honey pie <laughs> sometimes. And when I'm fucking her, <laughs> she says, Oh, come on my face. Oh, <laughs> Toppy, come on. That's a oh, TMI. We have children yeah. Well, to well show. <laughs> I have all kinds of topics. You're so, so you're so polite and so, that southern drawl, and then also you say you're well, fucking your wife. And you... I I got all kinds of topics, including fucking my wife. <laughs> uh, you could talk about coming on faces. Toppy, come Jackie. on. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I, well. I'll keep You're it. Gross. I'll keep it to regular other stuff. Then I'm sorry. Well, well, you can hold on. Let me look at my little notepad here. Oh, you got a notepad? Yeah. Do you see? I got it sewed to my inner thigh. <laughs> Cause I got holes in You're my like pocket. Like a Clyde Barker character. Well, just that part. I got holes in my pocket. And then when the notepad. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute. Oh, I see that the, 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 the notepad it it falls to out. Your, yeah, it's, it's not actually stitched one. to your flesh. It's it falls out. Stitched and then to the pants. It lands wearing. on the ground, but and I hear it dangling behind me. That's what those bells are for. <laughs> well, you have bells to let you know when yeah. your notepad falls out of your pocket. I put gum on them though, so they don't make any noise for the for your show. This is such a c- very complicated process you have. All right. Well. What about why don't, why don't you, you just keep notes on an iPhone or something, like I, Justin I, does? I don't know about what that is. <laughs> it's like a you know, you don't know what an iPhone is. I never heard about that. Wow, what are, boy, maybe I should write that into my notepad. <laughs> that might be a good topic. Yeah. All right. Well, let me see. You guys, you ever hear about that guy? He uh. You know, he's a terrorist now. He had a website. Oh, Julian Assange. Yeah, yeah, you want, why don't you talk about well, him? I think your commentary is a little, I mean, you're editorializing. He's not a terrorist. Why don't you talk about that? That seems like an interesting topic. The wiki, might... You're talking about the WikiLeaks. Yeah. I don't know anything about that. Oh, all right. Well, so Toppy, I would like that. Toppy, do you know anything about that? Well, it's Christmas. <laughs> why don't you talk about, you know... Jesus Christ. I mean, that's what this is all about. Uh, uh, are you a believer? Well, Stop you know, it. I believe a lot of things. Uh-huh. Do you um, believe it that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior? Does my cross bother you, Tom- Tommy? Toppy? <laughs> your, is your what? My, Jack- my cross. Oh. Well, he's no. not he hasn't, he hasn't made it clear yet. What I is love uh, everything. Uh-huh. You're yeah. like some sort of... Uh, Unitarian uh, or something. <laughs> like a Unitarian? Yeah. You believe that like there's some truth in a little bit of all the faiths? Hey, fates? you remember those stuffed animals from the 80s called Popples? Yeah. Why don't you talk about that? <laughs> those are pretty popular. Wow. Just, think, about mean, all the pro- think about all the units that got moved. <laughs> they turned from a creature into a ball. All the units that got moved? <laughs> Every unit is consists of at least 24. What? Why don't you talk about that? What are you that? talking about? Are you talking about like like how they're well. That's how re- business has worked. How do you know so much about business? Well, I guess you're I'm tappy, top of the yeah. topic. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Remember that ET Michael Jackson album? Talk about that. Did you guys hear wait, about wait, wait, the wait, family wait, wait, wait. that Michael Jackson like was friends with for years? No, no, no. And they're releasing an album. It's no. crazy. It's called. We got molested. Talk what about is that. It? No, oh, they're saying what a loving person he oh, was, and right. they're from New Jersey. Can I? Can I? I want to try an experiment. Toppy, you seem to just have these topics just at the, just the, the, right at the tip of yeah, your tongue. Yeah, that's what I was made for. Can you ra- rattle off as many topics as you can in the next minute? <clears throat> All right, ready and go. Korea, North Korea, they're crazy. Why don't you talk about that? No. All right. <laughs> well. What about bubble wrap? You wrap your packages in it. Where does it come from? How expensive is it to make? I don't understand any about that, but it's free. All right. Uh, UPS. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You have uh-huh. to always say, why don't you talk about that? Oh, why don't you talk about that? Next time. No? Next time. Oh, okay. Hey, Nerf balls. You know, you got to be careful with those. The very first one was just one ball. Now they got guns. Talk about that. Why don't you talk about that? Progression of a company. Um, ooh, I know. Oh, what about paper? You know, it was originally called papel. Uh, it was invented by the Egyptians. But maybe the Sumerians had some. I don't know. Talk about that. <laughs> hey, why don't you talk about the Sumerians? They're crazy. You know, some He's of the their... zone, Jackie. Some of their artifacts... I don't even know what's happening <laughs> anymore. The, the some of the zone. artifacts have spaceships and... 
carvings, they All existed. Right. Is this enough? Yeah, <laughs> no, two thousand years going. before the Egyptians or uh, Jesus. I mean, I mean, come on. Maybe you should just think about that. Hey, how come our calendar starts two thousand years ago? That doesn't make any sense. We've been around a lot longer than that on Earth. Why don't you talk about that? Hey, what about magazines? Print media is going out. It's time for new media. Talk about that. Any of these? What about Carl Sagan? He was a legendary space person. He had all kinds of space theories. Maybe talk about that. Trophies. <laughs> Think about what trophies represent in our culture. It's when you win something. Talk about that. Any of these? <laughs> products. You go to the store to buy products. That's a pretty broad topic. No? <laughs> I, I, I want to keep my options open top. Yeah, I'm sorry. There's so many great topics I just said. I mean, I really feel like I'm not being appreciated here. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, I... Uh. I've been giving out all kinds of topics. No, they're all great. I'm just I mean, marveling. I'm, I'm you, marveling at your ability. I'm sorry, but I, I'm feeling a little, a little taken advantage of here. I mean, I'm spitting out topics left and right, and I don't know what. what are these not good enough for you? What do you? What, what more do you want from me? I mean, I, I was designed to make topics. I feel like I've given you so many topics, you could fill a whole couple of weeks worth. Hello? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, Jackie? Uh, uh, Jackie, what's wrong with you? Come on. What's happening? Uh, I'm just trying to help. Poppy's just feeling frustrated because yeah. we're not really using him. I'm just trying I'm to listening. help. You know, it takes two. It takes three. I four. mean, I, I give a topic and then, you know, you talk about it. <sighs> what about binoculars? They help you see long distances. They have some with uh, anti-stabilities. Why well, don't you oh, talk about that? You're making me so tired. Okay. Are we doing email soon? <laughs> Toppy? Yeah. I'm sorry that, uh, I, I, you know. Hey, Merry Christmas. <laughs> you know, I, I think that the, I think that the, that, the, that the segment, the topic was how many topics you could, you could give us. Oh, yeah. I didn't realize yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well. It was quite impressive. Well, you know, I'm. I could go on all day. Well, um, t-shirt, iron-on t-shirt. No, okay, I think we're done. Oh, but uh, I appreciate it. That was pretty impressive. Yeah, I never really, you know, we never really tested you before. Did you know that Dr. Dre has a brand of headphones you can buy at Best Buy? They're supposed to be really high quality. We could talk about that. Actually, I would like to talk about that. Okay, go <laughs> ahead. Uh. So he, so Dr. Dre, uh huh, he has a brand of headphones. Yeah, I'm, I for, I'm getting so <laughs> bored and sleepy. Oh, sorry. Did you know that sleep is one of the most important things? Talk about that. No, Jackie, do you want to? Why don't you uh, ask Poppy some questions? <laughs> Jackie, you can ask me I'm anything so you want. Tired. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and just say I'm gonna be especially open and honest. To any questions, so whatever, Jackie, Jackie asks, whatever you want to ask Toppy. Because it is Christmas Eve. It's Christmas Eve. I'll do whatever you want, Jackie. It's Christmas what Eve. What a gift um, you're getting. I'm just tiny and blue. Can you, go, little, can you leave? No, Jackie. That's more, more of a demand. He's a question. little blue. I'm so <laughs> getting so tired. He's a little blue creature who has an uncanny ability to to, to conjure yeah. up an unlimited amount of topics, I'm, and I'm, you want you don't have anything to ask him. He's married. Go ahead, oh, yeah. ask me how, anything. How heavy is your wife? I think I asked that before. How what? <laughs> heavy. Oh well, you know, I mean, considering we're both pretty little, she's you know about maybe ten pounds. Oh, how much do you weigh? I'm only about five pounds, oh. but of course. That's because my bones are hollow. Uh -huh. Oh my god! Wait, I'm still never clear. You're you're human. You're I'm sort of a weird, you know, blue thing. You refer to yourself as a thing? Yeah. You know, do you come from a race? Well, you know, I'm just one of those. I'm just a thing. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm a topic. 
I mean, I'm topping the topic, you know? <laughs> you want to talk about mm, paper sacks? You know, now they make plastic ones, too. When you go to the grocery store. You know, Toppy feels like uh, the conversations I'd have to listen to on the train ride home when I'd worked worked at Cartoon Network and I took the train up to Santa Clarita. I'm not joking you. It's you like Toppy. Like a homeless was, man? Toppy was everyone that sat around me who wouldn't bring a fucking book hey. and just wanted to talk about yeah, anything. Uh, reading the news oh. that uh, Hugo Chavez is... Uh, no, 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 no. It's exactly, starting to privatize it's his oil exactly fields. exactly like talk about Toppy. That? Oh, you could talk about, I mean, oh, it would go like yeah. this. Okay, pretend I'm a female toppy, okay? Oh. 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 Uh-oh. Oh, okay, do, ready? Do you have big titties? <laughs> no. Big old okay. titties no. and nipples oh, hard. Oh, five nipples. Pounds. Now listen, toppy. toppy. Oh. I'm going to be oh. female toppy, but this okay. is female my train toppy. ride. Oh. This is my train toppy ride yet. home okay. oh. on the Metrolink toppy when toppy I used yet. to take the train. Toppy meets toppy Ooh, yet. My exciting. little toppy penis is hard. Hey, where'd you get that sweater? Oh, oh, I like this. this oh, yeah. Hey, where'd you get that sweater? Oh, I, I, I actually bought this sweater from Target. It was part of a... Oh, you bought it from Target? Yeah. I buy sweaters, too. I buy them from Target. Oh. I buy them from Walmart. What's your name? I buy them from J.C. What's your name? I buy them Don't from Don't hold Sears. out on me. I buy them from What's your the Gap. Name? I'm talking. I buy oh. them from Old Navy. Oh. He's rubbing himself. Oh, keep going. Hey, where else do you buy? Where'd you get? Where'd you get those oh. shoes? Oh, yeah, you really hit well, the top of buttons. You know, I got these shoes from Payless Shoes, but I also got a pair from the, you know. Shoe I like shoes. Pavilion. I like shoes and leather. I like oh. shoes and cotton. Oh. I like shoes and alligator. Listen, lady. Yes? I'd like it if you came back to my house and fucked me in front of my wife. Where do you live? Come on back and fuck me in front of my wife. Now get off on that. Sort Where of thing. do you live? My name's Toppy the Topic. I've lived in a lot of I cities. I want you to eat my wife's I've pussy <laughs> hole. Well, I've, I've lived in you. Las Vegas. Can you talk I've about topics? I've lived in Prescott. Oh. I've lived in Santa All right. Fe. I've lived in <laughs> Sacramento. What's your name? What's oh, your I name? got a lot of names. What's your I name? I can go by Holly. Oh. I can go by Jenny. I like the name I Holly. I can go by Kimberly. I got a lot of names. Why don't you talk about that? It's one of those... Well, this is like soulmates What do you here. want me to be called <laughs> kind of situations? Well, uh... You want to talk about telescopes? Toppy, what do you want to call her? I'd like to call her, um, Toppyette. Yeah, so why don't you go ahead and just take Toppyette back home to your wife and do whatever you do with My your wife. My wife is a social worker, and she one of her favorite <laughs> things is to, when I bring a strange home. And a the, strange? Yeah, you know, it's strange so pussy. Strange. Yeah. strange pussy home. Uh-huh. And I and we just get it going. Yeah. Does she like to watch you with the strange, or yeah. you like to watch her with the strange? Yeah. Or it's kind of all, yeah. all of it. <laughs> and the whole time you're like, why don't you talk about macrobiology? We could talk about Obama. Yeah. <laughs> so why are you having sex? Yeah, yeah. Sure. That's what we do. Yeah. That's my society. <laughs> It's your culture. Yeah. All right. Well, I, Tapiette, why don't you go ahead and take off with, uh, all right. Get, get, get out of here. All go right. back to the top. How are we going to gonna get to you? I'm going to shit in your oh. mouth. I'm going to shit in your mouth. Yeah. I'm going to shit all over you. Yeah. Let's go. Woo. Wee! Bye, guys. Wow. wow, so Jackie, Justin, what do you think about that? That huh? was crazy. Wow, boy, what, I, I'm sorry I was uh, reading my magazine. Yeah, hey, you were awfully quiet during that. Yeah, no, I was really focused on but something. But that, um, that was pretty intense. What happened? Well, Toppy, Toppy met someone. You remember oh, Toppy, right? Jesus. You remember oh, Toppy the Topic? Wow. how could I forget? Yeah, he came back, and he, his voice <laughs> sounded a little different at first. 
but I guess he just had some something, something going on. I can't oh, remember what he said. All right, well, whatever. But anyway, so then uh, you know he uh, we met this. Uh, first of all, he showed off his skills. He could just rattle topics oh, off nonstop. Geez, wow. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, this top yet apparently this female version of Toppy showed oh, up. Oh, showed up! Oh, they my really god. hit it off. And oh my god! Apparently, Toppy likes to. Now some... he's gonna take her and take a big <laughs> shit in her mouth. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's crazy! In front of his wife. You know, yeah. it's funny. It's funny that you know I didn't hear any of this, but it's funny, Jackie, that you mentioned that. Can I take a big shit in your mouth, Jackie? He's Toppy. Toppy the topic has all kinds of topics from A to Z. Toppy knows a little bit about everything from current events to anatomy. All right. <coughs> so this is real quick, just a little nugget, just a little segment. A little nugget. Just in the in the effort to make this show a show, a complete show. I have a quick story that I've been hanging on to and that we've actually tried to get to before and we haven't. Oh, we, yeah. That I want to tell this. on the podcast because I think it's interesting. Okay. And if I'm wrong, so be it. And Jackie, can you get off your computer and actually listen and chime in and be involved yeah. and not be reading about boys or whatever the fuck you're reading I about? I wasn't reading about boys. What were you reading about? Boys. <laughs> boys, boys, boys. Are you boy crazy? I've always been boy crazy. Are you drunk? <laughs> Am I drunk? Have you guys had a sip? Oh, no, really? Just okay. you and I are drunk. I'm, I'm a little tired. bit tired. Okay. All right. So it was 2006. Wow. I was balls deep in <laughs> Meredith Baxter. Who's Meredith, Meredith Baxter? Baxter Bernie Meredith Baxter from Bernie. Family Ties. Yeah, yeah, the, She's oh, a lesbo the now. Family Ties, yeah. She's always been a lesbian. She <laughs> was, she was, she let me fuck her. <laughs> no, um, it was 2006. We were working on the Acceptable TV pilot. Uh-huh. I know we got a couple Acceptable TV remember fans. Remember when we shared an in office, the crowd here. Yeah, Ryan and I shared an office. In fact, remember there's a video blog that I, I have that is in the Oh, dude, we have a ton of little short videos we made uh, in that time. Think about it. We did nuggets. Yeah. So anyway, Justin okay. and I shared an office. So I had a friend named uh, Brett who was friends with my downstairs Michaels? roommate. No. And he was really good friends with Tom Green, MTV's mm-hmm. Tom Green. Hmm. And I've known Brett for a long time. And every time he saw me, he'd say, oh, man, you got to fucking hang out with Tom Green. You and Tom Green, man, you guys Boy, would be best friends. the same cloth. Yeah. Man, well, I can't characters. imagine the two of you guys yeah. getting in a oh, room and but... the world's going to explode. <laughs> and I was like, say? yeah, yeah. So, well, <laughs> you know, more or less. And I was like, uh-huh. oh, wow, really? Okay. Huh. I don't know. Um, so they kept pushing it like, oh, man, you got to hang out with Tom Green. So finally, the day came. He's like, listen, come to Tom Green's house. I'm going to be there. You can, we'll just hang out, shoot the shit. You can meet him, whatever. So I'm like, okay. And I was super fucking busy. I was working on this Nick Cannon pilot, which oh, I've got a whole God, story about yeah. that. And then, and I was like animating and writing the host raps for this schizophrenia show, which I don't even know whatever happened to it. And then, also at the same time, animating the first episode of Mr. Sprinkles uh, for the acceptable TV pilot. But I left work early to go meet Tom Green. I was like, "Fuck it, I'm gonna, I gotta do this. This yeah. is crazy. It's gonna be fucking nuts." So I hop on the one on one. I go to, I go to Tom Green's house. He lives sort of, you know, in the bar. Give out his area. address. No, nice he house. Up- is he rich? Very nice house, single story, um, beautiful home. Yeah, I mean, wow. and it's in a very secluded, like hilly hill neighborhood. You know, up in the hills uh, uh, near Barham, <clears throat> which a billion famous people live right yeah. there. So I'm not saying much, but um, so I get literally a billion live there. <laughs> uh, so I get to his house. I park my car. I called Brett. Hey, am I at the right place? Yeah, yeah. He lets me in. I show up. Tom Green. Oh my God, Tom fucking Green in he's, his own house. He's he. You know, I'm I'm imagining like. Woo, ah, woo, ah, woo, you know, fucking like crazy. Ad- yeah, Robin Williams, Tom Green, like the uh-huh. lunatic, the nutcase. Uh-huh. It's fucking sleepy Tom Green I meet. Very, sl- very like cool, serious, sleepy. The fucking first thing he does, he opens this humidifier filled with like 10 different types of weed. And this Now is two- it's public knowledge that he smokes weed or weed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. So like in, in, in 2006, this was before the fucking like 8 billion dispensaries and like yeah. the medical marijuana loophole. I mean, it might have been just the beginning of it. In fact, it was it did exist, but it was very like rare that it wasn't like, like now. They're Starbucks now. Yeah, it's like Starbucks now. Back then it was like, you know, you might have heard a friend of a friend, did, you know, whatever. But he he clearly I mean, he had medical marijuana. He had just a fuck ton of it in this humidifier. And the first thing he asked me is like, hey. Let's fucking smoke. Let's smoke. Do you want to smoke? Like, do you smoke weed? Let, let's smoke some weed. And I'm just like, I, even back then, weed makes me fucking crazy. I get super paranoid. I, I go, I go, I think about death. I think about crazy shit. So I was like, no, no, 
now I'm cool. And I think that that bummed him out a little. Or I mean, he he did, he wasn't like, oh, okay, I'm bummed out. But I mean, I could tell like he was like, okay, yeah, he smoked killer. alone. With, him and Brett issues. smoked. Yeah, yeah, and I didn't. So I was like the odd man out. Mm-hmm. We couldn't bond, you know, over this, you know, yet or whatever at this point. So I'm like, okay, whatever. And I'm like, okay, well, what, you know, what? I'm fucking nervous. I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? I'm in Tom Green's house. So he's like, hey, come, come here, check out my, you know, I've got these rap videos I've been doing. He's been doing rap music, <laughs> but not like jokey, like you it's know, for real, like like sincere, like real, like rap music. Like he's serious and he's shooting really? videos. Yeah, and it's not like funny. It's not like Tom Green being funny. It's like he's like fucking serious like i'm How doing do real wait, like, is he the rap <clears throat> artist or is he filming him and other, like a couple of other dudes are actually singing yes oh how my do you God. how are you tom green and not how does he not have the self-awareness I don't know that's but, because when you become rich and you become a celebrity you lose pers- your perspective on what you're good at you think you can you're good at everything well that's, not everybody well does. that's not to say that it was that the rap was bad i'm not saying it was shitty what do i know all mm. i know is I didn't understand what I was seeing, and I didn't understand and how to react. And you were still sober? Yeah, yeah. I, 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 yes, because – And okay. you, yeah, you didn't know if you were supposed to go like, oh, yeah. I had no good. fucking – am I supposed to be laughing? Am yeah. I supposed to be like yeah, – is, yeah, yeah. is this like a, you're being <laughs> ironic? Like what? what is this? Yeah. I was so fucking confused. And at this point, I, 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 like this was, the, this was the second time he had asked me to smoke, right? And they mm-hmm. smoked again. And I said, you know what? Give me a beer, so I because I'm thinking, okay, I'll have a couple of beers mm-hmm. and then I'll fucking smoke with these guys because mm-hmm. like I can't just smoke sober. I'll fucking lose my mind if I get enough beers in me. I'll be sure. it'll sort of balance it out yeah. and I'll be able to like roll. So that's what I'm thinking. So I have two Coronas as I'm watching these rap videos and I'm just like totally confused. I look at Brett, not really helping me. Like I'm just <laughs> like, am I like, oh yeah, this is cool. This is great. Exactly what you said. Like, oh man, yeah, this is really good. Yeah. I don't know rap. Like, I, I mean, you know, it's sounds okay. What, what, what the fuck? Like, are they like pr- fully produced videos or just, yeah. just okay? Yeah. Give I mean, me, well, it, I mean, no, no, like, to be fair, what, they're not like them? lights and kids. Yeah. It's not like fucking sparkly. But, they're not just like, but is it with a bunch of low riders or is there people like going like this no, in the video? Are it was there a, dancers, booty no, dancing? No, no, no. Like, it was a little, it was a little more like, it felt like the Tom Green show version of a produ- produced. So it was a joke. So it was kind of no. cutting. No. joke's on when you. I say, when I say <laughs> the Tom Green version, you have Maybe to be familiar. Maybe he's the smartest comedian. No. He's no Andy Kaufman. You have to be familiar with the Tom Green show. I'm just talking about production level. It was like a camera guy in Canada by a bus yeah. stop, and he's rapping. And, and then, then it, it cuts to like, to, yeah. Yeah, it's not like fucking booty girls in a fucking beautiful sparkly set with in other Hollywood words, lighting. It wasn't just a camera filming him and his friends for one continuous take. It was actually somewhat edited and produced. Yes, and, okay, a little bit. I got yeah. it. I got it, it was a Channel 101 music video. I mean, it was, no, it was I totally nothing got it. I totally got spectacular. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was – there was no, like, wink. There was no, like – this is we're fucking around. But anyways, whatever. It doesn't matter. The point is, did I'm he sitting... feel the need to explain to you, like as someone who knows who he is? Like, no, he's just like, yeah, man, I've, I've been doing, I've been doing music, and I'm just like, what am I doing here? Like, yeah. I don't. He didn't know anything of my stuff. Yeah. Like, I thought like the reason why I was there is because he was a fan. Of, like, he yeah. saw House of Cosby's or something. No, like we had to actually look. We had to actually pull up my videos on his like in his computer room on the TV, and he was like watching them for the first time. And I'm and just what like, was that like? Well, it was weird. Was he I'm, laughing? Yeah, but it was sort of like, oh yeah, it's cool, ha ha. Yeah, uh, but it was very like, I don't. It just felt so like just weird. Yeah, and um, so finally they he asks me again, "Do you want to smoke?" He opens his fucking crazy fucking collection of weed, and I'm just like, "Yeah, all right." F- you know, I cl- I could tell at that point like. I have to smoke to fucking yeah. make a connection Dang, with this guy. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like totally – like I would have loved to fucking click with Tom Green and yeah. like say, yeah, I'm fucking hanging out with Tom Green this but weekend. You know what I mean? Like, not happening. Wasn't happening. But I think – you Will know, he be a guest on the show? Uh, Maybe. I don't know. So I well, – which Tom Green are you going to get? This one? <laughs> yeah. The That's Tom the fun Green. of it. So, so, I, so I fucking smoke the weed, right? Mm-hmm. I, within 15 seconds, 20 seconds, I'm just like mm-hmm. – as high mm-hmm. as I've ever mm-hmm. fucking been in my life, and it's not a fun. It's I'm I don't like I do not react in a fun way to weed. I flip out. Yeah. Usually, it takes at least two hours before I get to a place where I'm high and I'm okay. It's the first like hour to two hours that I'm just fucking wigged out, and so I'm I'm all of a sudden I'm I'm I have this hyper realization. I'm in Tom Green's house, this world famous fucking guy who I watched on TV. 
who was married to Drew Barrymore, who had testicular cancer on TV, who had his ball cut off on TV, like all this shit. I'm in his fucking house right now. I shouldn't be here. This isn't right. He's going to die someday. Uh I'm going to die. Me being here isn't going to protect me from death. Nothing can protect me from death. And I'm just fucking. You made a little bit of a leap there. The, the, the pot it was just all I, the, I leaped immediately to death uh-huh. I'm like I'm in Tom Green's house his fame won't save him yeah he's gonna fucking this die coil. this is where my brain goes when I get high mm. this is why I don't smoke weed he's gonna his fucking die his rap videos his that was not even in my head anymore I'm just thinking I'm in Tom Green's house so he so he all of a sudden the, the he has these two giant wolves and when I say wolves I mean they're shaggy giant like the kind of wolves you see in movies that are growling and feral. <laughs> like, these are giant fucking wolves with the blue, like, Was piercing eyes. Was that because eyes. you were high, or no, no, no. they really are? No, no, They, they, were, they were there the whole time. They were there the whole time. But as soon as I get high, I really notice them. He's got two fucking w- giant wolves. And this is before I had my own dog. So I'm not, I don't have that, like, that, that like, yeah. love for dogs that I have now. So I'm just like, oh, my God, they're giant wolves. And I'm not afraid of dogs. I grew up around them. But I'm just thinking, like, this is fucking crazy. There's giant wolves. <laughs> What, what the fuck? And then what's going on? What's are they watching videos? No, no. Still? Now, now, he, now, now we're in his living room, right? Uh-huh. Where he does, and he had the desk from the Tom Green show in the living room, and he was telling me about how he's going to start doing his own uh, show think, out of his yeah, out of his I living think room. It has been going on. It's like yeah, they're hooking they're hooking up cameras here. It's going to be a live web show, and yeah. this is the desk, and it's going to start. This was like right before he started his yeah, first yeah, episode. I remember, yeah. So, so I'm just like, what the fuck? I shouldn't be here. <laughs> And there's these dogs. So then he goes over, and in the living room, there's a giant birdcage with a fucking huge <laughs> parrot that can talk. And he takes the parrot out of the cage and puts it on his shoulder. And now I'm standing in front of Tom Green in his own home, in the living room, with the fucking desk from the show. He's got a fucking parrot on his shoulder. I have nothing to say. I'm, I'm concerned with what they're thinking about me. I'm concerned with death. I'm concerned with the fact that I'm in Tom Green's house and I'm breaking some sort walls. of cosmic yeah. – like this is not supposed to happen. This is wrong. I've crossed some sort of line. I shouldn't be in this home. And he has a fucking parrot on his shoulder. And now the wolves are jumping to get to the parrot. They're jumping up on Tom Green because they want to get the parrot. And he's like, down, 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 Sally, down, Boober, whatever the fucking dog's <laughs> names were. And the, and the dogs are Sally trying to eat Boober. the fucking parrot. I swear to God. I'm like, put the parrot. I'm not saying this, but I'm thinking, put the parrot back away. Put the parrot away. It was really making me uncomfortable. These, and so I finally I sit down, and I'm just like not looking at either Brett or Tom Green. The conversation's over. Ah, those rap videos are not funny. No conversation <laughs> anymore, and nothing's being said. And I'm sitting there in silence, and the dogs are like – you know, he, he they've sort of mellowed out on the parrot, and I'm just – I'm not looking at them. I'm in my own head and just like what felt like a fucking long passage of time. No one said anything. Just awkward. Like somebody – if you guys are so comfortable on weed, help me out. Like – Please, and, and and it wasn't like he was like throw me a bone. It wasn't like he was like Mister like comfortable to be around before the weed. It was like he was like a fucking zombie, zombified Tom Green. So now I'm high and zombified Tom Green and my friend Brett not really doing anything. So I literally a passage of time goes by and all of a sudden I just I, I'm like I gotta get the fuck out of here. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Like panicking. I need to fucking leave. I need to fucking leave right now. I can't be here anymore. This is fucking crazy. So I literally just like in the most awkward way possible. I'm sure they were both fucking just chilling out, and I'm mm. just like, all right, I'll see you guys later. I-, I-, I gotta go. And as I'm saying that, I'm running to the door. I go. I leave. Cl- slam the door behind me. I don't. There- it's not a normal goodbye. It's me sitting here having and then bursting out. i go all right i gotta go leave <laughs> i get in my car i'm as high as a fucking kite i'm freaking out i don't know what to do i'm like i don't want to drive right now I, I this is insane i'm so fucking scared i'm like i got to i got to so i get in my i start driving and he's in you know these windy hollywood hills yeah. it's just a fucking giant windy mess there's a guy of course on my fucking ass i'm going like as fast as i can this guy's like, like bumper to bumper to my car and I'm just like, fuck, please just fucking leave me alone. I uh, go around. They couldn't go around me. I finally get out. I'm on the, I'm on Coanga. Get, get on the freeway. I'm on the fucking freeway. Rush hour traffic. Um, and it's like, you know, I'm just fucking high. And it's like, 
oh, what are we doing? All these rush cars. hour traffic. Yeah, because it was it was like around like seven o'clock, like going oh, going God. towards Sherman Oaks, and I'm just like, you went to hang at Tom Green's house like five o'clock. Yeah, I left work. I left the offices. Yeah, and it was around this time of year, so it was dark when I was going. You know what I mean? It was like yeah. five o'clock, but dark. Yeah. You know, it was like fucking crazy. And I'm just like, what are we doing on these freeways? We're all in these pods. <laughs> We're in these fucking pods. These pods just zooming down this Wake fucking... Wake up, America. Yeah, like what? Are we all just completely insane? How can none of us realize the fucking insanity of this? We're in these pods on this crazy fucking river of Tom pods. Green's doing sincere rap videos. What the fuck's <laughs> happening? Anyways, the point is, it was a fucking nightmare. I got home. I fucking Brett texted you or called you or anything. I, I, hey, bro, what's I, going on? I, yeah, what, I definitely what talked to him since then. I don't know if he's ever heard this story, uh-huh. but uh, there clearly was no bond made between me and Tom Green. There was no effort between either <laughs> Their he nor I. Proved not to be electric. Yeah. And look, it's not. It's not. It's. It's. You know, I don't know. Maybe he was. I don't know. The I joke's don't... on you. That's what I gather from this. It kind of was. You've got wolves and parrots and all this shit, and yeah, you fell to... into it, and you did exactly what he thought you were going to do. Cut to him returning the wolves and the parrots to, like, a rent-a-pet <laughs> store. Uh, God. Like I we only... called last week. God, how badly do I wish that was all a hidden camera prank for some, like, you know, pot-related hidden camera show? Like, get somebody high and then just fuck with them. And then at the end, reveal. Like your camp stories. Not, but to be fair, get somebody high fuck with them and then say, you're on a hidden camera show. Yeah. That's just another layer of fucking. Well, it's like, it's, like, it's, like, it's like with my camping story. Is that what you said, Jackie? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like my camping story. I never, no one ever revealed it was a prank. Which is the best kind of prank, I no, think. It cheapens it to, to like fuck with someone no and then This was no prank. Tell them. This was me realizing that there's nothing that can protect me from death. Not even being friends with famous people because they're going to die too. Everyone dies. I, no matter how successful I get in this town, no matter how many of my dreams are achieved, but I'm your still work die. will live forever yeah, until yeah. you know the sun supernovas. Yeah, no, I'll be like Walt Disney, you know, yeah. and, and my fucking character, Mister Boopy D- Dupes, is going to be Mr. on Magoops. T-shirts Magoops. for a hundred years. Yeah. Who cares? <laughs> All right. Anyways, so we'll save you. That was my Tom Green story. Yay! It was very philosophical there. Saved and archived do- forever. <laughs> Can we do email now? All right, everybody. It's time for a little bit of listener email. Yeah! 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 I'm so excited because Jackie's back. And last week we really couldn't, didn't feel comfortable going through all the listening emails yeah. because oh, you could have no. no. It's just like, I was like, oh, I want to hear Jackie's take on this. There were a lot of things that you had to military. Chime in on. No, go oh. here. Ryan's gonna start busting them out. Boys, can we close this? Because I really want your attention on. There's the nothing email. on it. It's, I know. I still want to close off. it though. I don't give a fuck. There's been a lot of debate over this farting thing. Yeah. Farting still? and pooping. Oh, well, you know, we haven't gotten emails in so long because it's been a month. <laughs> Jackie, oh, right, it's, right, it's been right. forever. Were there a thousand or was there like yeah. ten? No, no, no. There's, there's a thousand. A ton. There's, there's a little less than a thousand, yeah. but a little more than ten. Yeah. Bigger than a bread box? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this one's subject is farting in relationships. What the fuck from, is a uh, bread box? It's from someone named Ryan. Yeah. Ridley. No, but he is a close friend of Justin. Well, let's maybe not close, but he's a friend of ours. Uh, I consider him we a really good friend. I consider we, him a good call friend him who Rye I never Rye? see. He's a really good friend who I never see. That's we call him okay. Rhyna. Okay. But he, he, and uh, I love the guy. He's fucking he's amazing. He's amazing, super. Okay. Uh, we're a little drunk, so we're probably getting a little overboard. Yeah, go ahead. Can, Off okay. of two beers? Three. Well, he's oh speaking for himself when he says a little drunk. Do you know Justin Ryan and Jackie? Oops. I love your show. I've listened to every episode. I'm writing because you briefly discussed farting in relationships in your last episode, which mm-hmm. happens to be something yeah, yeah. I know a lot about. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Your guest Romansky dubbed me the fart master. Oh! My father once told me that on his first date with my mom, he farted in front of her as a test. <laughs> He knew that as a flatulent person, he did not want to be with a woman he could not comfortably <laughs> fart around. So he figured he might as well test waters from the get-go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Up until that point, I had never intentionally farted in front of a girl I was seeing for the very same reasons Justin and Ryan laid out. However, one day I decided to take my father's advice and fart immediately in front of a girl on our very first date. <laughs> Oh, did they fall in love? Well, I'm sure you can tell where this story is going. They got married. I ended up marrying her. See? Yay! Points for me. Now, hold on. A beautiful story. Number one, I question the truth 
behind that. Oh, really? God. It's because I mean, someone maybe, agrees with me. No, because let me just say, so this, this particular true. person who I know is a very creative mind. Mm. He might have manufactured this. Now, I don't he know didn't. that. He didn't. If well, it is if he true, does listen every episode, if that's true, he'll write back and confirm. Yeah. yeah. Now, if – and, and I wouldn't put it past and By the him. way, Justin and I were at his wedding, so we know he definitely got married. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I believe it. And – and and then on the other side of it, it's it is true. And God, I'm just gonna shit all over my current girlfriend, and not just fart, but shit all you over. You always her. have to take it, and over then we'll the get edge. married over the top. And then you'll write an email to another podcast, and I'll say I shit all over. Her okay, fucking next, face. next. Okay, all right. It was like a fucking horror that's movie. That's one point for Jackie. All right. Yes. This next one uh, says invitation subject inv- invitation to prom for Jackie. <gasps> <gasps> is this for real? Yes. For real? Oh my god! Not made up. Hi, Jackie, and the other two. Yes, I'm a senior at Northwood High School in Irvine, California. That's close. <gasps> is this a joke? A no. buddy of mine, his name is Skyler, is having a really hard time finding a date for homecoming. Oh, I'm worried this 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 email was sent on November 8th, though. Might, Might be, be too late. Wait, too did late. you just say it was for homecoming? Homecoming, yeah. It's over. Uh, okay, well, let's Shit. read this anyway because okay. maybe prom is coming up. Prom is in summer, though. That's so far yeah, away. Baby, He'll yeah, find yeah, a girl yeah, by yeah, then. Yeah, baby, yeah, yeah, well, he's yeah. a hard time finding a date for homecoming. <laughs> he looks okay, I guess, but none of the girls like him because he was a backup dancer in high school musical, too, and that's not cool anymore. That really? I think that's how awesome. Fickle. So he can yeah, dance. How fickle, yeah. He doesn't get out much, so he's not meeting girls in, from other schools either. He's like me. I'll go. It I want to go. Okay, so you'll go with I'm Skylar. in. If he was in high school musical too as a backup dancer, the real the Disney one, right? Like the real I deal. I could see how high school kids would shun him for that. That is pretty like, you They're know, it's stupid, got that stigma to but it. But he can dance. Okay, keep that going. is a huge plus for a girl. It seems like all Skylar does now is sit in his shitty private condo. His parents emancipated him and made him move after he complica- after he complained about their cock mushroom garden, and commune with all the tall, this is a lie, mean, fake email. shirtless alpha male ghosts of Indian warriors at haunted bedroom. All bedroom. right, thanks for I'm reeling hoping, me in. <laughs> I'm thanks hoping Jackie can help him out with his funk. He's been especially sad since the skateboarding accident damaged his lyrics just enough, so he can't do a Super Mario impression anymore. <laughs> Now, Jackie, you say it's fake, which I'm not saying you're wrong, but I didn't write this. Yeah, this is the listener that wrote this. I'd send you guys a picture, but unfortunately, all my photos of Skylar show him stealing from the Salvation Army. Oh, God! And they're having a semi incestuous relationship with his retired cop dad. Please respond soon. I need to know how many shrimp cocktails to order for the limo. Who is this from? Yeah, who, wh- who is I, it again? I, he doesn't sign. I mean, he, you know, I see what his name is, but I, you know, he doesn't sign it with his name, so. Stig? Do you really know who it is? No, we no, don't know. Is this a fan? This I like love you. Guy. It's one I of the it's one you. of the best emails we've ever had. It's so when oh I read that, I was crying. My God, so fucking good. Who is this mystery emailer? I don't know, but God bless you. Best email. That made me so happy. That's email of the week. Love it. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Good email. All Send right. me more. So, are you here? That's Dig or whatever your name is. <laughs> Send him right to Jackie's personal email at Jackie Ryan's, at Ryan's gmail.com. wiping his nose. It had to have <laughs> yeah. been from him. Or just find her on Facebook through the I swear people to God, Jackie, website. I would confess if it was mine. I don't know. You're doing that weird wipey nose thing. Because I did coke during the break. No, yeah. you don't. You, you're getting sick and you're he, getting no, us I'm sick. Not. I'm I saw you blowing He snorted your nose. 20 lines. Okay, episode 20, Jackie's Corner. Just uh, hello again, Justin, Ryan, and Jackie. Amish Country Brandon here yes. again, and I absolutely remember him. I do. Jesus. From a long time I, ago. And I absolutely felt the need to write in about episode 20 and the fart poop debate. Yep. That went in on Jackie's, uh, went on in J- the Jackie's Corner segment. Uh, sorry, Ryan and Justin. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. But I have to side with Jackie in this one, and I'll tell you why. I suffer from irritable bowel syndrome. Yay! So my life revolves around farts and poop, <laughs> and I have to have a sense of humor about Wait, can it. I? can I just... Really quick, uh, I just want to let this guy know something. Check to see if you're not maybe – if you don't have an intolerance to gluten, wheat gluten. The guy might... says he's got irritable bowel syndrome. No, I know, but I know a lot of people that you had think... irritable bowel syndrome, and then they realized if they stopped it's eating gluten. wheat gluten, their whole life would That's an everything. What is irritable so... bowel syndrome? Just you have, you, fart you can either have cro- chronic diarrhea or be oh constantly constipated. Dude, dude just, oh just – it's, it, it's worth – trying out for a month if you've got the willpower just cut out all wheat gluten i know it's crazy because it's in everything but you have to just do that try it for a month go to whole foods or wherever i'd the rather fuck. have fucking diarrhea and i swear to god give me dude, the diarrhea it might change your life i'm not kidding diarrhea 
That's right. a new song. Anyways, all right. Uh, anyway, so, Keep so he has a, have a sense of humor. Cause it's yeah. I don't have. If a woman doesn't have a sense of humor about the subject or tries to hide it, then they're not for me. I think farts and poops are hilarious, especially <laughs> yeah. coming from women. Yeah. Don't hide it, ladies. Everyone does it, and it's funny. It is funny. God, I wish I could feel that way. Two points. Two points Two for me. Two points. Honestly, you can't feel woman. that way because you're not human. Maybe I will feel that way. Maybe, maybe, maybe oh, if I if I fall in love with a girl and I love her enough, oh, maybe I just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah right. Probably. You guys just hold it in. You hold in your farts and poops. Because here's the thing: if a no, but that I, is fucking Jackie, dumb. I don't have this guy's problem where I'm constantly billowing up with shit and farts. <laughs> yeah, you are. You, I've smelled you. I've shared an office with you, and I have smelled you. He Jackie, smelled you. You're yeah. being very I mean. mean. I'm not being mean. You. Don't have a meltdown, Justin. <laughs> ah, I quit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Go uh, on. Two honestly, points. it would be great if more women could come out of the bathroom and yell to their significant other, sweet mother of God, go check out the monster. Now dump that I don't want. I, I don't agree with that. Oh, what? You don't, that's you what you do. I do it. I'm not saying, though, oh, that that's something that women yeah, should no, do. Because you're like, you're like, it's not for amateurs. <laughs> I know how to do it. You know it what right. it is, though, Ryan. You know what it is. I think if you're dating a girl or you're whatever in a relationship or married, for for Christ's sake, it's all about how the girl handles herself with the act of the fart. With the act of the fart. If she's like, oh, 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 oh I'm so Gross. sorry. I'm so sorry. That's, then that's bad. That's okay. like, oh god. But if but she's, she's like, like if she's like, if if you're close enough, and she's like, hey, yo, faggot. Right in your face. <laughs> yeah. What are you gonna do, bitch? Then it's like she owns okay, it. All right. Owns okay. It. I, yeah. I, you know what? Fair enough. Fine. Yeah. That's co- okay. You, you you got me. Yeah. You got me. I still adore you. But if she's like cooking and she's like, oh, 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 I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> then it's like, oh God, awkward, <laughs> horrible. Oh, it's fine. It's f- relax. And then it just fucking taints your yeah, everything done. about her. Is all of a sudden you're done all you can think done. about is that horrible. You know, it's like it's like oh, I got a fart. You know what? Hey, dipshit faggot! I see, this is, <laughs> right in their face. I'm not, gonna ah! lie. I'm not gonna lie. The hottest girl I ever dated. Yeah, hottest. I mean, like not even just hot by my standards. Like empirically. So she was under two fifty. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Gorgeous woman. She one time I was sleeping and all of a sudden I was having I'm not lying, I was having a dream. Uh-huh. And in the dream it was like a war scene and a fucking like <laughs> missile was flying. I, you've told this story before too. And keep going. And I remember I remember like like it was so loud uh-huh. that I woke up and in real life she was mid fucking ass <laughs> rip. Just <laughs> the loudest mo- like like yes. it, it, it it traversed both my Unconscious and my conscious mind. That's how long you and was loud frightening it was. about that. But like, she was gorgeous. God, I hope so. I did don't you do care that. after she farted? No, I don't know what it was because she kind of did. It was like just that she didn't really give a shit. It was kind of like, oh, whatever. You know what I mean? She was like, I told her, I'm like, you know, I told her, said, you wake up. You, you know what you just did? She's like, oh, oh. And she kind of laughed about it. You know what I mean? She wasn't like yeah. freaking out about yeah, it. Yeah, she, she's like, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck's your problem, queer. Yeah. You're like, oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, maybe yeah, I'm you little maybe, dick queer. Maybe I'm dumb. Yeah. I mean, if a girl handles it like that and she just fucking, like, owns it and is sort of, like, funny about it, fine. If you could – it's all about your fucking the attitude. Way you deal wow, with look at how the tides have changed. No, 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 Some but – well, uh, You're coming around to this. Well, no, but the thing is, when you Next talk about email. it – email. All right, fine. Because this Can't is s- not what you want. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've already oh, oh, discussed <laughs> this. I've okay, already fine, talked fine, fine. about Kent's this. Kent's Corner is the best. This is next email. Oh, did Kent write this email? Uh, no. <laughs> hey, I never wrote it before, and I'm going to call someone a fart mouth, so please don't use my full name. Anyway, I just listened to episode 20. <laughs> These emails are so dated. And that guy that said that Kent's Corner was not good, that guy was a Fuck fucking him. idiot. Kent's Corner has made me laugh. I agree. Cry, was Nobody said twice. that. I agree. Somebody on Facebook or something. So screw the, that no. guy. He's a fart mouth. He means that everything that comes out of his mouth is a fart and not a sexual fart like Jackie likes. Man, that's really become a theme. But it's nasty shit flecked fart. And all no. females are farts too. You should ignore. That kid wasn't, just it just wasn't even that bad. Blah, 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 no, he blah, said blah, blah, fuck. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, he ta- you're not, you don't know what he's talking about. Oh. You need to be on the Facebook page to get the full I don't want to even look. Yeah, exactly. Next. You don't go on the Facebook page, Jackie? She hardly I ever did. does. Okay, this next email, subject line, greatest podcast ever. Hey, Grandma's Virginity Crew, just wanted to say this is my favorite podcast out of every one that I subscribe Aww. to, and I have been listening since episode one. Wow. I am 14. Yay! And live in Florida. Oh. 
Justin. Yo. Coco Beach. And all of my friends that I've told the podcast about absolutely love it. And yes, they're all 14 too. Oh, I just yeah, they all hang out on 4chan. Question. Oh, Jackie, there's a big stain in your pants, girl. What is Shut that? Shut up. Right? It's poo. Right around the crotch area. It's growing and spreading. What? I just happening? have one quick question. Blood? No. Vaginal lubrication. What I have is just this? one quick question. <laughs> What yeah, is this? Going. You've turned into like some lech. I know. Well, no, I'm not. It's not. It's because you like just young teasing. boys. Yeah. Could I send in music of my own to be played during the intro, ending, yes. and during the edits? <laughs> no. Yes. No. Yeah, Listen, that's... send your music. We'll play it at the very end of the is show. Is it a boy or a girl? Speaking of which, is it oh, a boy or a girl? Yeah, we have yeah, the, yeah, the yeah. weirdest song yeah, we ever get to that. in the yeah. world. Oh, well, yeah, we'll get to send it. it. Just curious because it's really hard to get noticed in today's musical world. Oh, yeah. No, listen. Uh, totally, dude. We'll just throw out the whole fucking tone Theme of the, yeah, the whole. Yeah. Listen, listen. This kid's 14. Give him a break. Yeah. G- d- nobody gave me a break at 14. Oh, your whole life's been a break, <laughs> no. shit face. Hi. Can I? Huh, can, can, here's my shitty Next comment, email. slave labor graphics. Will you publish me? No response. Next email. You did that? Yeah. Well, yeah, we're not you imagine slave labor it, graphics. Point is, could you imagine? Yeah, we're a little more interactive, I know. But the point is, could you imagine slave labor going, ah, oh, that's fucking, it's horrible. I mean, clearly this kid is not ready. Eh, go ahead, give him a comic. 22 okay, pages. Well, he, goes on to say, he goes on to say, I play metal, so it's okay, it's okay if you guys say no. I know not everybody likes it. Plus, it could be possibly a segment where you review music listeners. Send send in, I don't know, I'm not a podcast genius like you guys. Okay, send your music in. And we yeah, will I'll maybe it. critique it as a segment yeah, or show it at the end of the Definitely show. send music in. We will we will figure out a way to, to work with it, but we can't replace our yeah. absolutely brilliant and also, <laughs> interstitial music. <laughs> Don't forget, if your music is shitty, we're going to rip you apart. Yeah, we would love to be able to review things. Okay. Uh, so now we'll be cool. Wade, we'll be cool. P.S. Jackie, you're so hot, and don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Wait, Wade. Yeah. I know him. I want to fuck. No, him. I. St- come on. I come on, ride that train, him. train. Uh, ride that way, Wade, train. Please do come not on, listen to these animals. Yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, baby. I oh, love that. Yeah. Send your music. We're Send animals. your music. So Jackie thinks we're animals, Justin. Animalistic uh, tendencies. Uh, That's my new band. Even. Yeah. Animalistic tendencies. You hear that, Wade? Corpse Grinder. You can open up for me. <laughs> okay. What's this, his band's name? Did he even say? You know. No. This next one. Uh, Call hi. yourself Animalistic Tendencies. Okay. Hi, GBP. Sarah Jane here. Jackie, you know who oh, I am. Oh, yes. Who this? Who this? Who this another, bitch? Another yeah, who this? Who this bitch? Friend. Yeah, who this? She's so cute. Wow. This OMG. Is great. I love your show. I've been a long-time listener, and I think all of you guys are hilarious, and I especially want to say hello to Jackie. Yes. Thanks for yeah, talking yeah. on Facebook. Yes. Anyway, guys, Justin, you are a goober, and keep it up with your the with the your silly buttons and people. Oh, mm-hmm. Ryan, I thought your story about the calendar was hilarious, but at the same time, I bet it wasn't. Can't even remember it. The the, what, little, the little, nudie, little sexual girl, molestation yeah. calendar when I was a little boy. So, oops. oh right, right right right. Jackie, a story about the sexy ghost made me LOL. Anyways, keep the great work. P.S. Silver Cute. Silverman rocks here. Jane, you ain't gonna. And then she goes on a quote a lyric. I don't know what that was. Okay. Uh, oh, well, we have a guest. Hello. Hold on. Hello. Hey, yo, what's up, fool? <laughs> yo, yo. Are hey, you psychic abilities? Hell yeah. <laughs> it's me. Psychic abilities, fool. Hello, yo. psychic. Yo, hell yeah. What's uh, going on, bro? Uh, you know, I'm just hanging out. Yeah? Yeah, you know, I got a... Last week, fool, I got a... Uh, <laughs> you know, I had to do a thing, you know? So I'm oh, hanging you out. Like you're explaining deal? your absence. You got a record deal. Yeah, yo. With what label? Oh, uh, you know, got to fucking put them together. What what label, so, though? Yo, like, what music you label? Any, uh, what, are you signed? You know. <laughs> Who have you been working with? What famous artists? Oh, hey. Uh, well, I am with the Black Eyed Peas. <laughs> Maybe. Been, yeah? Hell, yo. Dr. J? Yeah, I know him. Uh-huh. So, yo, what's up? Uh, you guys got any questions? Uh, yeah, no, I want to. I want to ask yet. you celebrity I'm questions. Si- I'm psychic abilities, fool. Yeah. I, you want to know about the future, Jackie? Yeah. Go ahead. Ask him something. About yeah, the yeah. Future. So we can well, move on. Yo, the email okay. Done. Um, will the future bring me a handsome, rich, tall? Uh huh. Does penis size matter to you, Jackie? <sighs> this is psychic abilities yo, time. Yo, yo, fool. Well, you got to be clear what you want. Yo, yo. Yo, why don't in you? my future. Uh-huh. What if he's handsome, tall, muscly, uh, rich, World War II, oh, yeah. it up, but a one-inch weenie? Jackie, you <laughs> oh, didn't hell specify. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah, fool. Yo, yo, it's me, Psychabilities, fool. Sp- 
Quick, second. Sorry. You want to know the truth? Yeah. What you want to know? <laughs> what do you want to know? Yo, ask me a question, Jackie. <laughs> Real quick. Go ahead. Say it again. Uh, Say it again. Uh, the same question? Yeah, yeah. What do you want? Ask him. Go, go. Am I going to meet a handsome, rich... Young man with what a one inch penis? Oh hell yeah! Oh hell yeah! You have your, you have your oh, answer. Oh hell yeah! I don't know. Yo. Does that mean yes or no? Hell yeah! Yo, oh yo. hell yeah! You are. What is it? What do you think it means? I don't know. It's so mysterious. <laughs> yeah, I'm psych abilities. I got the future full right here. Yo, yo, I'm psychabilities full. I got the future yeah, right here. I'm abilities. Go. Go I got abilities. Go I got abilities. I got abilities. Go yo. psychic. Yeah. Go psychic. All right. Hey, I got to get out of here, Peace yo. Out, psychic. I got a party. Thank you. Yeah, he's going to party. Wow. Wow. I well, think he's great to have around, like, maybe for the new year for our resolutions oh, and yeah. stuff. He could really help us out. Well, how do you feel? Do you think that you're going to meet this guy or... <laughs> with the, with the one-inch wiener? Yeah, and muscly and rich. Yeah, that's know? a good yeah. question, though, uh, Jackie. If you if you met a guy who was just, like, like just fucking Perfect. ripped, like, like, <laughs> like, 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 big pecs and, like, thin little waist, six-pack, like, you know, dark, dark hair. Yeah. Real attractive face. James Franco. Real funny. <laughs> James like, Franco face Like with sensitive, a sweet, body. but also like, you know, wait, like wait. like tough. And... Is it James Franco? No. Oh. And it's just a guy. It's well, Okay, fine. It, fuck it. Yeah. It's James Franco, Franco with the one, e- one, one inch wiener. And then you get yeah. in the room with him and it's like that you first time. I'll take it. I'll take it. Really? Pants down. I'll it's take literally it. like the size of a one pink eraser. One fully erect. Like, you know those pink erasers oh, so at school? So it's like deformed. <laughs> yeah, it looks, it's thin. Fully erect. Throbbing to full capacity. I mean, it's one essentially it's like a, being with a woman because he really can't. And it's really a pencil can't... eraser? No, it's a, it's a human penis, but it's fully the erect. The only oh way you can... Jackie, the only I way... I had a friend who had that happen Like, him, his tongue way. would be more effective in pleasuring you. Like, <laughs> yeah. just jabbing his tongue inside of you would be more... What would you... Would you, would it be okay? Would you accept the loss? If it's James Franco, uh, yes. But how would, like... No, it's a guy who looks just like When you're looking James at Franco. James... His okay, is, yeah. His okay. name is John Danko. Okay, and you're looking at He works at Staples. You're looking at John Franco. Oh, he has have a good job <laughs> no, 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 oh. no no justin i thought you said no, no. He was everything rich. else is great except oh, for the one in fine he, okay, he, okay, he's okay. a dot rich com, he's, dot he's com. rich danko J- and he's Looks identical like to franco. franco and he's sweet yeah. and rich yeah. and all this he loves all farts and poops and all that stuff yeah and he's yes. in bed and then it's like you reach down his pants and you feel yeah. a little one inch erection. i don't care really if he looks, if you're saying it's exactly like he is James Franco. No, he's not. He looks similar but to him. But he is like well, what him. What is the sex going to be like then? Um, oh, and it also, doesn't matter. I, you just said he was wait, rich. Okay, I, wait. How rich? Like a billionaire. Jesus. Yes, of course. Can you're I, fucking crazy. Can I add a couple would of you things, li- though? Would you lie? Would you go like, oh, oh, Hold on. pound me. Two things. Two oh, things. Two things. Smash real quick. my C. He, he, he doesn't know how to perform oral sex at all period at all he's horrible at in fact it. he's got a f- and number two metal tongue when you first reach down into his pants it's you're thinking diaper. oh is this a skin a skin like a, like a skin flap like a like a uh, is this some sort of like skin tab uh, oh no that's is that a oh my god that's that's his fucking penis <laughs> and clearly the penis like just barely it's like you can't even feel it it's so tiny when it goes in you your your clitoris that's cool? is you're bigger. cool with that your clitoris is bigger you're okay than with his that penis. But he is some sort of dot com, like you know, he rich guy. Like Am I like allowed James to Franco. have affairs? No. He if he found yeah. he's very protective of you. <laughs> if he yeah. found out, <laughs> the, it, the plot thickens. he's incredibly like, loyal, yeah. but yeah. not his penis. His if he penis found out that you're having <laughs> an affair, thinking. done. You're fucking out. Yeah. He would fucking be so upset. It's and not. Cry. Would you make Come him on, wear a strap James, on? Jam, you... James Franco. No, no, like. Jackie. It's John I know, but Danko. a billionaire John Danko. Give me a break. Would hey, you make Jackie. him wear a I mean, strap on? Ridiculous. Could he wear a strap on? Would that be like weird? <laughs> somebody's we here, please? Jackie. Wait, somebody's here though. I'm not answering. I'll answer it. Fine. Oh, this is James. Oh, I didn't John answer Denko. it. I didn't answer it. Hold hey, on. This Hello, is John Denko. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, hi. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> hey, my name's Ron Fanko. <laughs> oh, you're like a spoof of John Denko. No, well, listen, I'm real similar to, to John yeah, Denko. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a doctor. In the sense that, uh, you know, I got a barreled chest, uh-huh. thin, uh, you look, muscular four pack. You look like a guy who looks like James Franco. Yeah, I look just like James Franco. Yeah, you look like a guy who looks like James Franco. <laughs> yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, listen, I'm smart. I like when girls fart and shit. Yeah. And uh, oh, what else? Wow. I'm like, you know, I- I'm a tough else? guy. You know, I, cl- I mow my own lawn. You like World War II? I take care of my shit. <laughs> yeah. I got a clean, fancy house up in the hills. I'm rich. I'm a dot com. I own a dot com. <laughs> uh-huh. Which one? Uh, you know, sexup.com. It's a porn site. <laughs> 
But you know, who roasts? Yeah, I'm not no, interested. No, no, no. But listen, Don, Don. I'm only the I'm only the money guy. I'm not yeah. even worried about. Do you own about... any other ones? Like maybe like oh, uh, you know, I also own like you know, petsupplies.com. Oh, own that. Okay. You know, okay. all right, cool. I love pets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know, well, listen. Anything uh, else you want to tell us? Yeah, yeah. Yo, my name's Ron Frank. Ron. Ron. Uh, Janko. Janko. <laughs> and I want to bone that little piece of ass right there. Uh, What's that name? What's your name? Jackie. <laughs> Jackie. Hey, listen, Jackie. Hey, check out my fucking stuff. What are you packing down there? <laughs> Look, yeah, I'm pulling pulling out right now. Wow. Look at that. Oh my god! Oh, yeah, it happened? looks like a mole. It looks like what a mole. Happened? No, no, that's my penis. What happened? It it oh, looks come like, on, it, guys. It, it, I've been getting this my whole life in the locker room. I know it only looks like a little eraser, <laughs> but give me a break. I'm a rich guy. I look like John or you look like a guy Franco, that, like that one actor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm good. I'm ready to roll, baby. Oh, oh also, my tongue is paralyzed a little bit. Yeah, I don't know how to give oral so, sex. It's amazing how you talk perfectly normal though i know it's crazy i went to therapy i uh, yeah <laughs> all right well i better take it off okay Whoa. see ya good luck oh well do you guys want to want to get his number no Never mind, no late. he okay. said he he owns like weird.com yeah, i'm not yeah, interested yeah. in that yeah, that was a big mistake Don that was Janko. ron ron janko yeah yeah okay. so he's different than uh what was the other guy yeah who john knows? john okay thank okay next, next email. email okay hey guys and gal my name is Jason from Davenport, Iowa, mm-hmm. and yours was the first podcast that I've ever listened to. Oh. Wonderful. For some reason, the title well, What do you want, me. a fucking medal? For some reason, the title intrigued him. I wonder oh, why. Oh, gee, good. Finally. I've been listening since episode number seven. First off, I'd like to say that I think Ryan did a very good job with the Sarah Silverman interview. At least he actually took the time to read her book, which I've also read. Hilarious. Ask your person. But who asked question. the best question? I've been a fan. Well, like, not according to this guy. I've been a fan of hers for years and was sorry to see her show taken off the air. I'll definitely check out the new movie. Hope this, and hope the shower scene doesn't end up on the cutting room floor. <laughs> wow, these people write long ass emails. Yeah. I mean, I love okay, it. Well, you can paraphrase. God bless you. Okay, well, it says. We like this guy. He's a, he's a, he's yeah. one of the good ones. He basically says that he understands why, you know, you didn't want Jackie to open up the collectibles. He's got Citizen South Park collectibles. Yeah, of course. And all this other stuff. I mean, it's absurd. Wait, he weighs in on the farting and in front of the thing for adding the Christmas theme jackie yeah okay uh i'm gonna to have to side oh my god with, with me jackie Woo! that's three, three obviously he's not fuck. talking about the first date though <laughs> he's but talking about that first kiss once you've been together for a while it's okay to let one go yep i've, d- I've dated both farting 100. and non-farting women and in my experience farting women are more outgoing and funner to be around yeah yeah Agreed. other times Oftentimes, they're even better in the sack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But Hello. please, no farting in the sack. That's just not All cool. right, Shecky Green. Next yeah. email. Next. You agree with that, right, Jackie? No, you don't. That's a line you don't cross. Do no, you? while you're fucking, while you're you let farts it? out. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the, isn't that the point? Queefs? No. Uh, have Asshole you queefed? farts. I don't do any of that. <laughs> She's just a little Jackie with asshole I farts don't know in the chamber. What you're no about. air gets up I, in there. No, never, do, never, do, never, do, never. Do. Okay. okay, all right, Justin. You realize how hard the editing is when you hit, when you do that. Listen, this yeah, we're not dummy. we're not editing anything about okay. this email segment. Email this is for all good. the show. Ho, hi guys. I'm a big fan of the show. Lately, my wife and I have been having issues with yeah, our downstairs neighbor. Are. They stay up all night listening to shitty music like Bare Naked Ladies and yelling. <laughs> Bare Naked Ladies have some good songs. No, no they don't. It's God. been one week since it is. Of course you know a that. A chicken song. wing and a fried chicken. Yeah. <laughs> a booby loops and a lappity doops. It's like that's their lyrics. Keep going. Come this on, email's guys. funny. Somehow they also wake up before us so I can't retaliate to being loud in the morning. I wanted to see if any of you had any had advice or bad neighbors. Oh, yeah, I do. Tell. I know what. Eric from I know exactly what to do. Yeah. I live next to shitty neighbors that played like really, really bad bad um techno euro techno music it was awful they never turned it down i was working like two jobs at the time having to get up at four o'clock in the morning they'd play it all night they didn't care i told the management like hey please do something nobody did anything so i went and i stole letterhead from the like apartment manager's uh, you know, little unit, and I created a letter on the Ooh. Park Sierra letterhead that was like, um, "Hi, we've been told by several uh, neighbors <laughs> in the unit that your music has been blah 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 blah. You, if you don't turn it down, like you will be evicted in thirty days." And did they Whoa. stop? Music stopped. Damn, Jackie. So fuck them, Jackie. I got a lot to learn from you. I you know. Take things in there, you Jackie. Take that matters. is. Advice of the week. That's a lot like what maybe a young 
Uh, James Bond would have done <laughs> when he was in college. James Bond, the college. So years. that's my advice. Do it. You know, you hear that you NBC. Gotta, you've got to. You hear that NBC. <laughs> James Bond, the college. Who? What? What company owns the rights to James Bond? What is that? MGM. I think. Ooh. But no. But MGM just had a whole like someone. I think isn't NBC or Albert what? Broccoli. Who's buying MGM? Because MGM's like up I, in do, flux. What, what okay, whatever. Like fucking young deadline. James All Bond. right, entertainment know. news. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. MGM's getting bought up by fucking somebody. I don't know. Yeah. I'm Mr. Filthy. <laughs> Phil, 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 Philvins. Are you your competitor? I'm Michael Philvins. Mr. Scoop with so. Inside Track. Okay. Um, anything else? Any other bad neighbor stories, Jackie? Justin? I mean, not Jackie, uh, yeah. Justin. I had a neighbor who was so bad. I mean, they were how just, bad were they? He was so bad that he would show up with a bat over his head. <laughs> Can oh, we you're move drunk. on. I get my G's and move D's on. confused. Okay, so do that. Steal some light. Be a scammer yeah, and a scammer. Got, yeah, you've got to steal. <laughs> no, seriously head. though, I've always had good neighbors. Thank you. Uh, here's an email from Sarah Rome. Hey guys, Yay. I am so mad. Loco is now banned in Philly where I live. No, I need some support, guys. Thanks. But here's some good news. I met a girl who looks Wait, exactly she like. Drum roll, please. Justin Bieber, aka Baby Carrot. You can figure it out. No, I can't. She's a total barf bad. There's fucking lingo going on right now that I don't. I mean, it really is showing our. Can you send us a website gap. with some sort of like how we can? What like, is oh, it? Oh, she's a total bamf badass. But some dickhead spread a rumor. We made out lie. But what adds? Badass the motherfucker. Fucking stupid as shit. Rumor. She spelled rumor. R O O M E R. Oh, stop doing spell Keep check making on fun her. of me. I love it. Oh, Sarah. and also sorry for clogging your Facebook every Friday. I just love you guys so well, much. Well, I think, I think, I think, I think bitches love you, bamps. Keep doing what you do and love I, Sarah. I think. Yeah. I think we. I think we've successfully cured her of that by not doing a show in a month. <laughs> no, she's still posting. Oh, all right. Well, I haven't been looking. All right. Sorry. Okay. Uh, this guy is uh, Nate. He says, on my iPod Touch, I listened to the song Justin wrote for Crazy Chick and Double Speed, and it sounded cooler, more like soft rock. Oh, you know what's funny? I actually have that song slowed down. Mm-hmm. And I always thought the same thing. Like, I, I, I did it. Oh, like, once you slow it down, it sounds normal? No, of course not. Well, it does. It does sound like because she has that sort of high pitched. Like, is that that? Hey, I got a dick in my mouth. No, no, what? it's that little girl that I recorded. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And when you slow it down, she does sound like an adult, and it's mm-hmm. equally as creepy and weird. But it definitely has a different cool vibe, vibe to it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So awesome! I'm glad you figured wow. that out. Uh, from Nate, uh, from Nate, from episode eight, holy deity, deity question. What? Uh, P- he wrote a question in deity. episode eight. Deity. Oh, okay. P.S. I'm 14. Not that you care. Yes, we do. I do. And I really want Pigs of People back. It's the best part. Hmm. Oh, well, huh, it's coming back, baby. 2011. <laughs> the first episode of the new year. We're going to have some motherfucking Pigs of People shit. Up oh, in that. I won't be here. What? What? what you no, it's the first pigs episode of, yeah, of 2000. Yeah, I'm saying it's pigs. Uh, you'll be here. It's, a, it's just a tiny here. little. We're just gonna yeah, no, I won't. I won't you'll be, no. be here. Well, what, what do you like being here for? <laughs> Um, she likes it. Keep going. Next thing I got out. an al- free album download and some career enthusiasm. Oh, you yeah. just like when you show up to Justin's And house. Walking Dead. Yeah. And Walking Dead. Yeah, it's really okay. good. I can't wait. This is from... Uh, and I got a second season. I can't wait. This is from And Robert Sage... Kirkman's our buddy. We love him. Oh. Okay, name dropper. Sage Diamond Russell. I'm loving this yo, podcast. Yo, yo, I'm Sage Diamond Russell. Yo, I'm a wrestler. <laughs> Shut Ladies and gentlemen, up. I'm loving this podcast. It's actually the only one I listen to. I'm 29 years old, and if I were, was to choose to date Justin or Ryan, ooh, this must be a young Cute, and her name's Sage. That's no, or a gay Or a gay boy. No. Either one is fine. I'm loving this podcast. If I choose to date Justin or Ryan, it would definitely be Ryan. <sighs> Send a picture. I like a funny but serious guy, <laughs> and Justin seems like he would be too much to handle. Lady, you don't know me. Ask Send me. a picture. Ryan needs help. I have a very serious and sensitive Sage side to me. Sage is a really uh, cute name. You should ask this lovely, wonderful, beautiful, amazing girl that I'm yeah. now officially date. Uh, she's my girlfriend officially. Mm, good for you. Officially. Congratulations. You. Hey, did my did the gift idea that I told you did that like send her over the the yes. edge where she I, was like Jackie Hi. suggested I get lingerie. Ooh. Why, Jackie? Or maybe, did I ask you, or did you actually suggest I said, that? did you get her a gift? And then you said, oh, 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 oh. And I said, oh, I think it would be a really good okay. idea if you got a really nice lingerie. Really Why? Quick. Because. Well, because it, well, she was right. But here, hold on, can I just say really ex- quick? Can I just say really quick? I got her all this lingerie, right? Mm-hmm. And then I found out 
from other people that don't just get her lingerie only. That's fucking horrible. Get her lingerie and a vibrator. No, get her lingerie and something else because the lingerie is kind of a gift for you too. And they're not uh, wrong, okay. Jackie. Yeah. Obviously. So the lingerie was amazing. It was a home run. But the Did real home on? run. Turn you on seeing her in it? Oh, my God. Are you fucking kidding me? I don't She's know. gorgeous. I've never she seen a woman in lingerie. She is fucking gorgeous. Just naked, she's gorgeous. But okay. wearing lingerie? Come on, Holy maybe shit. she doesn't want you to say things. Okay, fine. Like that. I'm not saying her name. Okay, so anyways, listen, she's the hottest girl I've ever been with. Ever. Dated, I think. Even the one you lost your virginity to? Yeah. Are you joking? Well, you said she was built like a Playboy model. Yeah, Can well. Can we go on? Okay, I want to talk about what a genius I am. Point is, the real here's Good how I did it. holiday gift idea. Here's how I did it. Here's what I did. Okay, so I had the you lingerie. Should pay me. I had the lingerie really quick because I don't want to derail you the listener email. Should pay me because email. you probably did it. You probably performed intercourse, and oh, I deserve. We did for so long. I deserve really. Did you? Oh yeah, for like hours. Oh, you pay. Like not uh, not to too much information. Everybody <laughs> in the crowd. This but is hold this on. will all get edited out. No, anyway, no, it's fine. So. I'll leave it in. But here's the thing. I got her the lingerie, but then I was like, I have to give her something else. It's right, really right, thoughtful right, right. and like yeah. big. A money shot. So here's what I did. And all you boys out there who want to impress a girl, this is what you do. This is the 21st century gift that you give a girl. It's fucking, you cannot lose. An e-card. And I fucking created this. I invented this. You go, you buy a fucking awesome, fancy little mini pocket hard drive, like what you brought today. Yeah. Get the best one you can. 500 gigs. And then you fill it with everything that the girl likes. All the music that she would want that you, oh, she doesn't know about. Oh, yeah, that's a good Mu- yeah, TV yeah, yeah. shows. You fill it with, like, programs that she needs. You fill it with, like, tutorials. Like, I got, like, Final Cut tutorials. All this shit. I filled it up. All these specific to her, what she yeah. had talked about to me. All this stuff. And I gave her the hard drive. Perfect. And, I, and then I said, and she opened it up. She's like, oh, it's oh, I could so use this hard drive. I'm like, yeah, well, it's also Plug filled it with. In. Yeah, that's great. She fucking teared up. Yeah. She teared up? Because it's so thoughtful. thoughtful. Cuckoo. Yeah. Yeah. What? No, I think that's great. No, that's what you, you did want. The, you I did know. the I'm perfect balance. bitter, balanced. Justin. You I'm bitter. You did the perfect balance. But which one did you give first and second? Obviously, I gave the, the, the lingerie last. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Because I'm a fucking genius. No, what? I'm hey, a genius. I get half credit. But she's so, but she, your girlfriend's and so dumb. And just so dumb. you know, dear How girlfriend. How dumb is she? <laughs> no, no. She wore the hard drive and tried to play music on the lingerie. <laughs> Listen, dear girlfriend, Justin was totally against my suggestions and was no. like, this is stuck and stupid. Can I clarify? You like shitty things. Can I clarify? You like grandma's underwear. Jackie was yeah, showing me the creepiest it's grandma. Bu- uh, just so you know, it's bullshit, Ryan. I can show lingerie. you what, I can show you what Do I was you have lingerie? No. She are you was serious? showing me like no, I don't, mom's, I have nothing. mom's lingerie. That is such bullshit. You don't know anything about vintage lingerie. You're an idiot. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> you don't know anything. She's showing me here. here yeah, here's, because get uh, this. because uh, what? Betty My Betty Page wore that. Betty Page looked really disgusting in the lingerie she was wearing. Kind of. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> shut up. I mean, look, the one problem with Betty Page is the clothes she was wearing. <laughs> Take them off. Oh god. Hip hugger uh underwear. Put Betty Page All in I that. wear, Ryan, FYI, just because you're very interested, is yeah. long johns. To bed? For everything, for okay. underwear, and All I right. wear diapers. Next email. Okay. I wear diapers well, for she, underwear. She goes on to say that, Jackie, if you, if you, oh. say you, don't, you say you don't mind looking at other people's poo, but you think it's disgusting to look or smell your own vomit. Interesting. So yeah. since you have a method of getting rid of your own yeah. vomit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right after you puke, have you ever found yourself in a situation where you were going diarrhea in the toilet and puking at the same oh, time? Oh, yes. How yeah. did you get rid of your puke immediately after? Oh, that was very difficult. I, I had to just endure it, take my shit, try to hold my nose, wipe very carefully, turn, pour the bucket out, and then sit back down on the toilet and do it again. I've had that twice where I was, com- you know was coming out of both ends. It fucking I, thank sucks. God. Knock on wood. I've Ooh, never had to do it. that. You're going to get it. No, nope, because oh, I, I just can't knocked wait. on particle wood. It's- <laughs> That's the best. You are gonna get it. It's the least you could. All this yes, happiness. You are gonna get it. All this Not happiness. This all this yes, happiness. You get you have. <laughs> if there was any justice in the universe, you would have it this week while you're in Christmas. No, I shouldn't wish that upon Justin. No, come on. I'm I'm, I'm a no. good guy. You got me these spy sunglasses. What am I yeah. saying? I'm and just y- so lonely and bitter and depressed. Use the spy glasses to offset the loneliness. Go out and video. T- just <laughs> walk around your neighborhood. I swear to God, you should. I swear to God, what you should do is wear the sunglasses and walk around and just talk to people. Yeah, yeah. While you're recording. Yeah. And then go back home when they're filled, transfer it all, and go out and just keep doing okay, it. I'm go to Starbucks. Talk. You know, I'd like to get a caramel, but leave them on the whole time. <laughs> yeah, Dude, I will. Oh, please, I will. please, I will. please. We'll please. have video for the show. 
Uh, even even if it's just for me, I just yeah. want to have a party where we just yeah. watch <laughs> video where people don't realize they're being recorded. Oh, please, God. Okay, this is for my cousin, Diana. Yeah. Ryan, Jackie, Justin. First of all, I loved episode 21. It was so great. Uh, also, upon hearing about Abbott's legal trouble, troubles, it reminded <laughs> me of Ryan's expired license. Uh-oh. Ryan, have you corrected this problem? Yes, I have. Oh, oh good. Oh, oh yeah. wow. Hell yeah. Dirty Diana. Oh, I you never press that one. Sometimes. Next. Tyler Watkins writes, Yay! Hey guys, loved episode 21. Abba's and I realized I love the suck dicks. Was crazy. Just kidding. Uh, I love the guy. I'm just and kidding. Ab- hey guys, loved episode 21. Abba's story is crazy and I hope it becomes into a community show. It will. Uh, Can we? No, we might not. Fuck able, it. Yeah, they're they're making one. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> fuck, 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 is Ovid gonna get any money or anything? Uh, isn't that isn't that weird? It's like I kind of thought about that for some. Like, wait a minute, they're like literally like when they make a movie out of someone's life they story, to they gotta pay. But Ovid yeah. tells these stories, and he now they fucking make right, twenty five. Okay. Come on, let's, let's not, not be right. the let's not be the, the that's not right. Let's, Ovid. Not, let's not be the guys that are shaking that. I boat. know, but he needs to get something for his <sighs> no, trouble. Stop, that's stop. not Look, fair. Um and and also to be fair we, gotta we have Dan no back idea. Got to and grill him. Yeah. All right. Well, we also have no idea if if that episode. I mean, I've been in a writer's room. I worked in a writer's room, and a lot of stories end up on the cutting room floor. All right. So, so who knows? But we hear rumors, whispers, yeah. innuendos. But it would be, be an fucking awesome. Goes to jail episode. And if it does, if we do find out it's it's it goes to be shot, we're uh, gonna talk about it like crazy. Let's go to visit, okay. visit the set. Yeah, we'll again, visit the set. And I'll uh, get a chance to yeah, sit down, yeah, Allison. Yeah. All of us. Okay. okay. All right. Um. Anyways, uh, I'm about to graduate and try out for a football team. Any tips on losing weight, working out? Yes, I have a tip. Please, can I just say really quick? Yeah. Uh, number one, calorie counting. Religious calorie yeah, counting. The iPhone app. Or, or if you have to, just keep a diary, whatever. But every fucking thing that goes into your fat fucking mouth, you dumb piece of shit. You fucking Stop. log those calories. No, fuck you. I'm sick of this shit, you fat people. You fu- <laughs> every fucking little nugget of shit that goes into your mouth and down your fucking throat. Write down in a goddamn book how many calories that was. And if you don't, then don't fucking complain about how fat you are. Okay, so now then that's step number one. Step number two, you want to make sure that you regulate the calorie intake per day. So your goal, I'm going to say, I'm going to set you at about 1,600 calories a day. If but you if exceed he that. has to chat for the football team, he needs to bulk up. So uh, um, I'm not done. I love coming from Justin. No, excuse me. 1,600 calories a day. If you exceed it, then fuck you. It's your own fucking fault. Secondly, uh, or thirdly, sorry, uh, you're going to need a lot of protein, and you're going to need to exercise hard. You're going to need to put yourself really hard. So part of your calorie intake is going to be protein shakes, 130 calories, 27 grams of protein three times a day. Um, Factor that into your calorie intake, intake, a lot of protein, and you need to exercise at least three times a day. Strength body exercises where you're actually like either doing 100 push-ups, 100 squats, and 100 sit-ups Which all in a row. Which you can only do one. Uh, no, I do. I do. I'm fine. Let's I'm see. okay. How many push-ups can you do? My, I'm so sore right now because I just oh, did them two days ago. But right. point I is, I can do 100. Lie. I can do more than 100. But the that's point a is, lie from that's, both of you, Jackie. Really? A hundred push-ups. Easily, yes. Easily. Me too. Easier. Lee. I want to see this. Okay, do you want to you want to hang out when I do my next exercise? Do it yeah, now. Yeah, no, Justin. why don't you just do it now? Because I'm it's fucking Okay, what Ryan, do 100 push-ups. I can I don't no, even think no, I can. No, do no, 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 stop. Ne- right. Okay, that's my oh, advice. Okay. Take it next, or leave it. Next Oh, also, uh, also, podcast. also, 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 also uh vegetables, fruits, meats, uh seafood, blah blah. blah. Okay. Did somebody next say email. fruits? Are we almost done? <laughs> oh, who's that? Ryan, Hello. are we almost done? Yeah, we're almost done, Jackie. Okay. Wait, can we take a quick break? P- I, no! break. I have to go to the bathroom. No. P.S. You got to. No. P.S. Shh. P.S. Four Loco was called back all over the place, and I think you're the ones who cracked the story. Not, the drink, <laughs> not the drink killing people, but how bad it was. Congrats. Yeah. That's awesome. I'll take credit for that. Fuck it. Jackie, your Christmas present to me is that we're going to finish the emails. Okay. So we've our got fans, three more. We have three so more to go. Fans, right. We've got Wake three up more. on Christmas Eve day. And with a fucking he- heaping helping. Heaping more. helping of emails Next. answered. This one is from Vanessa. She says, hey, guys, just wondering if the snail mail is going to be set up for Christmas cards to be sent or socks Aww. for Ryan. Thanks, Vanessa. Send anything you want. Socks, Christmas cards, two, 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 one, four, one. five, five, 
Why don't we give an address? That's your, out? That's your, I have I have a PO box. I guess. Oh, what is it? What I think is that'd it? be okay, great. Go for it. Please send all Grandma's virginity related gifts. I want a present, even though it's past. Whatever. I yeah. want a present. I never get any presents to for Christmas the anymore. Following address. You really have a PO box? I want. Go on. I don't want to give it out. Just fuck it. It's a PO box. What else? All right, fine. One one six eight four. Ventura Boulevard, box number 711, Studio City, California, 91604. Perfect. Send, Send me, me a present. Send me a present. Send me. I want something handmade. Send me something weird. I want something handmade. Justin, Send- what, what, why do you have a studio? Why do you have that P.O. box set up? Send me an iron mask <laughs> for my fans. Are you serious? Yeah, I got tons of fans all over the world. How, how many things do you I, You get? know, I got lots of fans. How often do you go check the P.O. box? You know, once a day. Once a day? Seriously? I mean, like twice a day. No, how, how, seriously, Justin. I, you know, like twice a day. How often do you, do you check the P.O. box? You know, like twice a week. Uh, why are you being honest? I don't Can know. What do you move on? Oh, how, do you get a lot of stuff sent there? Yeah, I get like, like fan email. mail. Oh, God. Okay, greetings, youngsters. Gunner from Norway here, 28 Yo! anime and such. Oh. Gunner? Yeah, he's going to gun her down your Yo. your lady part. Shut up. I enjoy your Coast. podcast a lot and threw together a piece of art for you. And the role of the grandma is none other than what might be Norway's next prime minister. We have a lot of listeners in Norway. Yeah, I want to go there. The I'm hora, not joking you. We should. We should do a live show for Norway. Gunner. Live can from I Norway. Come, can I come to Norway? Gunner, please. Norway. Gunner, buy your ticket. Round trip, fly her in. Oh, I would die. Anyways, Introduce her to your friends. I love traveling. She needs to experience a slice of life. Yeah. <laughs> a nice blue Norway, head, blue Norway eyed is man. so close to Germany. <laughs> All right. Okay. Enough. Enough. Continue. Uh, so, yeah, you want you, you can go find a nice Norwegian man and do your role playing Nazi fantasy. Yeah. Continue. Anyways, he did, he did some art. He hopes we like it. He likes Kent's Corner. Bye yeah. now. Loving. Oh, no. I'm not answering. I'm not answering. Don't. Keep reading. Okay. This next episode. It's hard, though. These these people are all equally persistent, these little characters. Um, I'm just going to open the door. Crack. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not going to let you in, sir, but or ma'am. Hello. Who are you? Oh, Mario had a stroke. It's a Mario. He had a really Mario. bad stroke. No, no, Jackie, you don't know it's what happened cold. to him. We, we learned last it's week something more serious. It's a cold what? outside. He was... Raped. Yeah. By who? By Bullet Bill. It's a cold. I want to come in. Please. Mario, a... we don't have time for all this. I'll, I'll be a quiet. I'll be a quiet. It's a cold. It's a cold <laughs> it outside. It's kind of cold outside, isn't it? Okay, it's fine. A... Fine. You melted my heart. What oh, can I say? It's, it's a Christmas Eve. <laughs> yeah, it is. I'm a cold. Oh, okay, you just Christmas... sit down by the fire and be quiet. Let's go oh, on with the email. Well, I'm just curious. Did you do some Christmas shopping, Mario? Yeah. Yeah. I bought a uh, a couple of things, you know, uh, for my uh, peep, my friends. Uh. Yeah. What'd you get? You know, I got a Luigi. I got him a board game, a Monopoly. Uh huh. And then I got a a Princess of Peach. I got her some bath and body. Lotion. <laughs> wow. No lingerie? Some... No, no. Uh-huh. No, you know. She don't like me uh, that way. Yeah, yeah. I got a um, toad. Uh-huh. He a tiny mushroom yeah, yeah, person. He working with a peach. Uh-huh. I got a him a uh, puzzle. He like a, the pu- he like <laughs> a put together puzzle. Okay. All right. Um, I'm a Louis. I mean, I'm a Mario. Yeah, we know. That's it? Okay, Jackie's gotten her, her opening up her, her present of justice. Yeah. Oh. Mario, I'm sorry. Can you just kind of kind of sit J- by the fire? Jackie, Jackie, yeah, J- Jackie, yes. Can I ask you a question? Yes. A question. Last week, Abed was here. Yes. I snuggle with him. Yes. He not as uh, billowy <laughs> and doughy and comfortable as a you. So I think what Mario is, no, I think what Mario is asking is, can, can he? I, may he have your lap? Yes, I, come lie down. Oh, I hope you like World War Two. Yes, Mario, did you see? Like, show at. Mario some pictures from the Holocaust. Show him some pictures oh. of Dachau. I haven't gotten there yet, but here's a picture of Hitler. Oh, yeah, Mario. Has you know he who been Hitler in your video is? Games? He's like a King of Koopa. Yeah, exactly. He's like mm-hmm. the King of Koopa of our world. Yeah. Now, did King of Koopa ever commit genocide against uh, yeah. millions of? 
Jewish people? Yeah. Or whatever the equivalent now, of Jews are in your he world? He committed a, a, a homicide against genocide. a million genocide of a uh, little tiny, um, the little tiny, uh, 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 uh uh, Jackie, will you show Mario some pictures from Ber- Birken Birkenbau, whatever? The- oh come <laughs> on, Buchenwald. Buchenwald! Look at all these shirtless men. I mean, forget that they're not. Jackie, these. Jackie, show show Mario oh, some pictures from the Holocaust. Sad. I just don't want to see. I just, I'm we curious what Mario. On, would, we don't want to bring the I'm podcast. I'm curious down. what Mario would think We're of those. We're not doing that. I Moving wanna, on. I want to see a little picture. Oh. Just show him, just Jackie one picture. I just want to hear what Mario's reaction is, just because he just needs pretend. to know this stuff. Oh, oh, oh! Well, you see that? J- that that looks like a he uh, being a stomped, <laughs> like when I a stomp uh, a goomba. It was a horrible event that happened about seventy years ago in our country. Oh, our it's world. like a winner. It's like when a king of Koopa first steal of the princess. Yeah, kind of like okay. that. I'm okay. gonna, I'm Just gonna take, nuzzle yeah, in. Yeah, go ahead. Oh. All right, lie down. Oh. Lie down. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, Justin, ready? Next. Yeah, next email. Okay, now that Mario's asleep. Okay, uh, Justin, Ryan, and Jackie, hello and happy almost Thanksgiving. This is pathetic. Oh, this is so shit. sad I dated this. Yeah, well, we blew it. My name is Allie Fillmore. I'm a 23-year-old girl from Maine. Cute. I'm a first-time emailer and a listener, emailer, and a listener since the beginning, thanks to Dan Harmon and his Twitter account. Oh, Aww. nice. Uh, that means Dan gets a little kickback. Yep. Um, first of all, please 10%. don't please don't shorten the podcast. I really like the long ones because they make the f- time fly at work. Second, please tell Jackie to stop flipping through that fucking World War II book and focus on the I'm, emails. I can listen as well as look so yeah, that I can we're stay hearing... away. Oh, sh- yeah. Okay, oh, I'll sh- turn quieter. And it's amazing that she wrote that in the email. Um, she says psychic? that she hopes things get better for you, and if she wants a shitty factory job in Maine, I can definitely hook her up. <laughs> Would you consider that, Jackie? No, okay. I don't want to do that. Third, I had a question. When did you guys know what you wanted to do with your lives, and were you always completely sure of your decision? The reason I ask is because in a few months, I'm going to school to be a baker, and the closer Ooh. it comes, the more I'm guess- second-guessing myself. Is that no, it? don't. No, no, stop. Listen. That's if you're great. a butcher or maybe look, a candlestick look, maker. Look, 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 look. Yeah, exactly. If you're if you're second guessing the career path of baker, <laughs> then get the fucking take a year off and find yourself because don't invest like 5 years of your life going to baker's school unless you're <laughs> fucking maybe goddamn she's really 100%. Good. Percent. No, but that's re- that's ridiculous. She- if you're really good then you don't need to go to school. You start a fucking store and yeah, you're badass. I guess you're right. My mom is a baker, was a baker, she had a bakery. Wow. Yeah. Wait, can I just Why tell this girl stop? really quick? She sold the business. Listen, she's an artist. When did I know what I wanted to do? I knew when I was fucking 2 years old what I wanted to do. The fact that I'm actually doing it, well that's a whole different story because I'm sure a lot of people wanted to do this and they're and no one's as successful as Justin no, no, Ryland. No. Love you, babes. No, but it's not easy. Email, it's not God. easy to break into this industry. But my point is, if you're struggling with the <laughs> idea of like, I can see if she's like, I'm a really smart person and I'm I'm going, I'm trying to be a doctor, then stay stay with that path because the uh, the field for. Like, the employment rate for doctors is through the roof. You could get a job so easy and get paid really well. <laughs> what? The job placement for fucking nurses and doctors is, like, the best in the country of any job. So I would say, yes, yeah, stick with that because that's a great fucking, like, career path. And you'll be financially stable and safe and whatever. But bakering? Baker? Bakeries? Get out of here! <laughs> okay, next email. Well, wait a minute, wait a minute. If you're questioning when that... When did we know... I knew... Me and Justin both knew when we were children that we were always destined for this Yeah, path. Jackie, when did you know that you wanted to oh, do it? Oh, why don't you watch my short film and maybe you can see <laughs> at the end what I say. I want to be a maybe actress. Yeah, we'll post no, it on actress? YouTube. An oh. actress? I want to make movies. <laughs> <laughs> I want to make movies. Yeah, that's right. At the very end of the movie. Watch it on YouTube, everybody. It's, it's called a, Don't Tell Ricky it's Scrotum. Go, go Tell Ricky, Ricky Scrotum. Go Thanks. Tell Ricky Thanks Scrotum. Thanks for the great plug. <gasps> and uh, Jackie, there's a video of her as a little kid. <gasps> you want to see that? And she says, it's adorable. I want to make movies. Yeah, and she did it. She made Go Tell Ricky Scrotum. And no one cares. So Jackie wow. actually also knew when she was very little. So listen, sweetie yeah. pie, let me tell you something. <laughs> you don't know what you want to do? You're trying to be a fucking baker? Get the fuck out of here. It's a hard industry to get into baking. It's a cutthroat yeah. doggy dog world. So you shut the You gotta want it, kid. Get the you fuck out of here. You gotta want it. Yeah. Okay, it next does. email. Okay. Hello, GVP, longtime fan. I just listened, finished listening to Abed's masterful tale of his time in L.A. County lockup. I also spent some time behind bars. 
fairly recently, but only for 12 hours or so. I can't imagine going through the three-day the three ordeal that Abed had to endure. I have to say, though, that the lessons I learned weren't so much about her, bugging my, hugging my friends and appreciating the sunshine. I mainly learned never to do anything that would land me in fucking jail again. <laughs> yeah. It's truly horrific and dehumanizing, but it made for fascinating listening. Keep up the good work. Listen, you guys. How can we get through the week? And Ryan, stay on mic, please. Thank you. Next email. This is from a uh, guy. Uh, and it says his name is Hospital Steve. And little. Oh, I think this guy's friends with Gunner from Norway. Oh. oh. Howdy. I'm Steve Cook, 29 years old, and you can say my name from Norway. And I am at the hospital right now. My five year old son Gunner broke his. Wait a what? minute. We'll keep reading. And maybe this is a common name. Maybe it's common no, it's name. obviously like John. his five year old son clearly didn't write the last name. Maybe if he's Continue. really smart. Uh, Gunner broke his nose playing a game that in English probably would be named Hit the Goblin or something of the like, where one <laughs> kid dresses up as a goblin and the other kids throw pebbles at him. Really? Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, that sounds really? fucking awesome. <laughs> oh my God. I Seriously, I'm not kidding you. If I was a kid, I'd be like. What? Let's <laughs> fucking play Hit the Goblin right now. Would you right be the now. Goblin or the Pebble Thrower? I figured whoever loses pl- is the Goblin, right? The loser becomes the yeah. next oh, Goblin. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, you, but, you figure it out. But one kid obviously got a bit overzealous and threw a biggish stone and hit poor Gunner right on his poor little nose. Oh, oh Gunner. Gunner. It's going to happen with a bunch of little boys. Yeah, and also- Someone's going to go, fuck these pebbles. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. not only that, fucking but you're- Fucking really fuck you're, this you're, Goblin you're, up. You're, yeah, there's a Goblin here. Yeah. We need to kill it. He's sleeping right now, but seems to be fine. It's, someone who has a child listens to this. It just it blows my yeah. mind. In Norway, like yeah, someone not? who tends to a little... That's what people tend to do. He even got some candy before he passed out, so he's probably pretty pleased. Oh. Anyhow, love the and show. And by candy, I mean... Don't. Mike. Don't, okay, Justin. Don't do Jesus don't Christ. Do it, Justin. I won't do it. Let's Anyhow, stop. love the show, although the lack of Rich Vulture grinds my heart bone. He's the best, oh. guest. He's the best guest yet, and that's really saying something. On another note, I really hope Mr. Scoops makes it out of the jungle, as we talked about last week. It's uh, it's looking yeah, looking. Uh, my search is getting closer. Okay, keep keep up the good work, or as the Norwegian saying goes, may your tools and utensils gr- glow on the breeze of safety and commitment. That is, how do you translate that into? I don't know, but okay. I love it. I'm love going and kisses to Norway. from Hospital Steve. Norway. I'm going to go to Norway. Norway. I'm going to. You you will ruin my trip. We'll go at separate times. Okay, good. Let's all go together. Okay. No. All right. Can I bring Margaret? Yes. Oh, I mean, can I bring my girlfriend with me? You Whose can name do whatever is? you want. Okay. Hi, Jackie, Justin, and Ryan. Uh, hey, GV. I've been listening to you guys since the beginning, but this is the first time I have had a chance to write in. A chance? Could Maybe include, he's busy. Finally, could include the schedule. It's not a he. It's a her. She. Sorry. Sorry. I just wanted to let you know that you do have another peer who listens. I'm 32. Oh. I work as a data entry specialist for a market research company by day and an artist by night. What do you want? Yep. A cookie? I'm teaching myself Jesus how to do animation Christ. too. I've been super awesome. busy juggling projects, but I do hope to make some episode art for you at some time. Oh, please. My day job is very tedious, so I basically listen to podcasts 40 hours a week, and you are my awesome. favorite. Can I just say that if your day job is so tedious that you can sit there and listen to podcasts, it's not not, not as bad as it might as some other people I've heard about. You're getting paid to listen to podcasts. Yeah. yeah, come on. I want to thank you for keeping Stop me it, company. Stop roses. <laughs> during gets a perspective during part of my life uh, during part of my time is spent mindlessly typing away so i have a question for you that will yeah. make an inter- interesting topic uh-huh how did your grandmothers lose their virginity <laughs> oh i actually know this are you serious yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. it's a family story go on uh my grandmother it was a black man uh it was no. 1930 <clears throat> no my grandmother on my grandmother's side. On <laughs> which is your mother's side? Sure. Uh, you know, she fell down and landed on a porcupine <laughs> cone. And next thing you know, no more longer a virgin. Broke the old seal, so to speak. Oh, wow. Porcupine cone. <laughs> All right. Next email. Wait, that was not a real story. Of course not. <laughs> okay. I, I don't know. I'm assuming that my grandmother... Fell on a porcupine. On both car. sides, uh, you know, one night had some nice, quick, and easy missionary style with a silky smooth sex. debonair black man, <laughs> like the, the likes of who's who was Lando Cal- Calrissian played by Billy D. Williams, like a Billy D. But Williams. But it was the 1940s when He's it like, was yeah, more but, risque. Dude, there were there were some smooth fucking guys 
black guys in the 1940s. Don't, I know. Don't be don't be fooled. There was a I'm couple not, you're of Billy. The one who's being racist. There was a couple of Billy D. Williams right? running around. Jackie, what? How am I being racist? Because you're saying don't be fooled. There were some smooth black men in the 40s. I well, know that. Hey, I, I, listen, I'm just stating a fact here. That's not me <laughs> being racist at all. And those guys were going around, and they were fucking your grandmama! Yeah! What? Yeah! What? Yeah! Next email. Next email. Hello, GBP. This is Rosie. I have written before. Mm-hmm. Rosie okay the Riveter. if you say my whole name on the podcast. The reason I'm writing is due to the little debate between Jackie and Justin Ryan, should girls fart in front of their yeah? More. Okay, get to it. What's what's your slice on it? Oh, then she sends a YouTube video. All right, next email. Okay, yeah. That, that, that come on. The fuck do you think so, we got here? Say my name, say my name. You acting kind of shady and on. calling me baby. Why the sudden change? Say my name, say my name. <laughs> Next Holy email. Crap. Charlie Wang. What's going on in communist China, Charlie Wang? God, suddenly it seemed lame to be one of the originals. Trust me, there's thousands of teenagers that are too shy to send you great messages, but cool smart listeners like me send email every week no matter how many you guys get. Wow, and no matter how communist I am. Abe sounds freak, poor guy, but to be honest, is this racist? Yeah, it yes. is. Yes. Oh, Incredibly. Okay. And I'm sure Charlie's going to be very offended. Bummed out? Yeah, and bummed out. Well, he doesn't out. even talk like that. He's not going to care. Yeah. He doesn't. We heard his voice. He has he like, sounds, almost like perfect yeah. English. That's like the most racist. Okay, can I just say, Charlie Wang, please, 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 when uh, China decides to invade the U.S. and like, be kill kind us, to us. Be yeah, kind like, to us. Can you find us and now protect us? Now that's racist. No, it's not. Yeah. Okay, That's next email. Not at all racist. It's going to happen. You guys' experiences are freaking amazing. If I ever get into an American jail, I'd get raped for sure. <laughs> <laughs> and every day, because my friends think I'm a girl. So anyway, can't wait to hear more about Abed. Also, wanted to know what you what you guys do if you find a cockroach in your meal. Well, we know what Justin does. Oh, oh yeah. His, no, I, uh, yeah, cockroach on my body. That story cut. He told a story about how he found one on his body. The other day, I was ha- having dinner with my dad, and we found a cockroach in our dishes. Ugh. We called the manager and asked, what the fuck is that? And he fucking <laughs> ate the thing. What? Oh, what? my God. You're kidding That's me. That's China. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Well, those people are crazy. They're going to come here and take over and kill us because yeah. they own They're half the country. They're willing to eat cockroaches. It is true, though. Wait, we, uh, there's a fly in my soup. Oh, yeah? Can I just tell you guys? What you call a fly, I call a motherfucking appetizer. We are living in the last days of society as we know it. It is about to change. China is coming in, baby. Charlie, will you please protect us? Please, Thank you. Charlie, putting it a word. After that, he kept asking us where is the cockroach, and we end up paying for everything. Whoa. Oh, that sucks. So he's like, oh, you that- mean, he's like this, is like, this is like the equivalent. Oh, you talking about this? Yeah. Yep. yeah no, taste, no, 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 no. What is asshole? Good to me. The not, landlord, no, 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 though. No, 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 it's not that. It's this. It's like, uh, excuse me, um, yeah, and the, we wait, there's a cockroach in our meal. Uh, uh, what cockroach? I don't see no cockroach. What are you talking about? Oh, my God. Mm. Uh, that'll be uh, $45. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he says, he says that Wang does not mean penis. It's his last name. Well, Love excuse me. Ex- <clears throat> Wang does mean penis here in America. In America. In America. No, that's wrong. It's West Side Story. No, that's no, from like fucking Fifo. No, that's. Yeah, no, no, that's that's you. no, 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 Justin, I'm. I'm trying yeah. to do the difference, but oh, big surprise. Justin's Wayne not penis letting in anyone talk. Wang means penis in America. Wang means penis in America. <laughs> we have been getting some. We have been getting some awesome episode art. Yeah. And uh, we're trying to figure out. <coughs> God, we really have yo, a yo, sh- yo, 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 yo. load, Justin, that we need to figure out for the next couple episodes. Okay, here we go. Hey, Grandma's Virginia Podcast. My name is Josh, and I've been listening to ep- podcasts since episode one, shortly after I heard Justin on Steve Agee's podcast. Oh, that actually worked out, huh? Oh, wow. Um, I'm a 31-year-old graphic designer up here in Seattle, Washington, and I also oh, like nice. to draw while listening to the podcast. It's been a pretty rough year for me. Oh. My cousin died in a motorcycle accident. Oh, Jesus. My uncle is fighting brain cancer. Oh, what? my Lost God. Lost another uncle leukemia. Is oh. this a real email? Yes. Or, oh, Jackie. my God. Losing my grandma to Parkinson's and my mom is fighting breast cancer for oh. a second. Jesus Christ. 
Now that you are all bummed out after hearing that, I wanted to let you guys know that despite all that crap, the Grandma's Virginity podcast has been a consistent source of comedy for oh. me throughout the shitty year, and I can't thank you all enough. Now, Jackie, hearing that, nah, my problem, I ain't got no hearing, problems. Jackie, hearing that, it's like, come on, we got to We got to have a responsibility. Yeah, our people, we're doing a service. Oh, here see, I wasn't show. even thinking about that. I was thinking about I don't have anything to complain about. Oh. This guy's problems are way worse than mine. Well, obviously, all I can say uh, is I didn't number think about one, the number show. two, I, why would you want to not? Provide these people with their entertainment and enjoyment. I never said I wasn't going to. Okay, so listen, I'm so sorry Only to hear all that times. shit, man. That's fucked up. And I, and yeah, I'm sorry. That's horrible. Horrible stuff. It's not good. No. no. But. It's horrible. But it's going to get better. So trust me, I know, because I'm going through a breakup, so you probably know what maybe like <laughs> half my pain is. Maybe, and, maybe, uh, maybe three quarters. Maybe three quarters yeah. of my pain is. And I know that when yeah. I'm. You know, entertained by something and to keep your mind off it, it does help. But can so. I just say, though, to be honest, like, I think I'd, like, if one of my dogs died, I'd be, like, finding a fucking knife to slip my throat with. Mm-hmm. So, well, who am I to talk? Yeah. You're, you're a stronger man than me is all I'm trying to say. It's true. Uh, anyways, he said that now you're all bummed out after hearing that. I want to let you know that despite, oh, I already said all this, right? Uh, <clears throat> anyways, good, keep up the good work, crazy characters, and lively banner. Enjoy this Enjoy this attached DBP theme drawing I did for you, and it's incredible. It's one of my favorite pieces of fan art we've gotten. And um, he says, what music artist album are you listening to On this mic, week? On mic, please, Ryan. What music artist album are you each each of you listening to this week? Uh, Explosions in the Sky. Check them out. Kanye <clears throat> West. Um, and uh, my girlfriend told me about them. Whatever is on 97.1. Amp Radio? Yeah. You've been listening to Amp Radio. Yeah, yeah, that's what I listen to. Good every for day. you. Good for you. You're such a liar. Good for you. No, he's that's serious. That's what I listen to for him. every day. Good for okay, him. Okay, what are their top five? Give me five songs from Amp. Like a G6. Like okay, a G6. Okay, okay. Um, that's one. The one that goes. Do three. It'll be faster. Okay, the one that goes like, uh, oh, God. Popping bottles. That's, that's G6. the G6. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love then, that song. Then there's another song that's like, uh, well, they always, the, they always put the Eminem song. Oh, that one's awful. You mean the airplane song or the uh, other one? That's B.O.B. Like airplane. Oh, right, right, right. Sky, yeah, 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 like yeah. yeah. So you know more than I do. Gonna, gonna wish right you know now, more than I right You have been. What's Fuck made you me. listen to Amp Dude, Radio? Dude, I listen to all the time. That's crazy. I love all that stuff. Wow. You all know, right. What? Next email, please. Do you please. have new fun you, respect you, No, I said uniformed Hitler youth learns how to fire the throwaway right. okay. anti- anti-tank okay. weapon called Panzerfaust. Please. Okay, next email. You guys is all right. I just saw Ryan's Facebook message, and I'm super glad you guys are keeping the dream alive. Keep fighting the good fight. Yep. Just a reminder, Jackie read my email in the episode where she was the official email segment leader. Yeah, yo. I thought she did great, by the way. Thanks. She pronounced my very Greek name perfectly. Alexander Lambropoulos. I was very happy when I heard you guys read my email while I was driving around delivering pizzas. Aww. So, hey, I did that. I did that. Michigan State University. Never did that. So, GVP is the first podcast I ever got into, and since then, I'm super obsessed with it. Mostly comedy ones. Uh, super obsessed with them. Mostly comedy ones. Mark Maron's WTF, Comedy Death Ray, and Doug Loves Movies are other weekly obsessions of mine. Yeah, the, w- the ones that get all the publicity. Yeah, all the attention. Yeah, yeah. Let's, pl- let's plug the those here. get richer and the poor get poorer. Yeah, yeah while, we, while we sit in, while we in sit obscurity. In obscurity. I quit. The redheaded stepchild of comedy nah, podcasts. Fine, we don't deserve it. We're not as talented or funny as them. Be- let, to be fair. Are you serious? Well, I don't know. Maybe. No. No, I'm not. I don't know. I don't want to sound like a, a fucking full Too of myself late. piece of shit. Uh, anyways, is, uh, can we remind any, uh, recommend any of the podcasts, Justin? Uh, the Joystick Podcast. Video games and three fantastic gents. Also, my brother, my brother, and me. Very entertaining. They they give advice and answer emails. Exclusively. I don't know what's happening. Yeah, I don't you're, know what you're talking about. Jackie, that's because you're Joystick. sitting there reading a fucking book. I'm not reading. I'm youth. looking at pictures. I can listen to this and look at pictures. How about like, interact? Joystick something Engage. or other. Okay, next email. Can I get the little thing so I can play the song, Justin? The, from the, the... No. <clears throat> what song? The song, the Norwegian thing. Oh, we're going to play that after the end okay. of the show. Yeah, let's so move on. So we got an incredible email, uh, an incredible song. Um... And uh, we are going to play that after the... Yeah, so so really quick. Please stick around for the end of the show. You're going to hear the weirdest shit I've ever heard. I'm not quite sure what it means. 
It's bizarre <laughs> and creepy, but please. It's a song? It's coming after Smith Harrison at the very, very end of the show, after the ending credits. List, stick around and you'll hear it. We're tacking it on like we did the fucking little girl song in that one episode. Enjoy it. It's good. It's from a listener. Who's his name? What's his name? The guy that sent it in, the, Ryan. And is he, he's Norwegian? Yeah. Wait, um, this is, uh, it's not a guy. It's a. Uh, uh, it's a human being. <laughs> lighter. Uh, lighter? Lighter. I think that's a dude, but okay. Robocool? Okay, Ra- fine. Radioterrible.com? So, credit where credit is due. Yeah. Okay, next email. Um, <clears throat> this is from Preston Olson. Hi, my name is Preston Olson. I think your podcast is fucking great. Keep it up. I love you all as a team that works well together. Love Jackie and Ryan and uh-huh. Justin. Love, 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 love. I have submitted some great yet half-assed artwork. I hope you enjoy looking at it. Yeah. We've been getting a lot of artwork. Yeah, That's we've awesome. Got, now we have too much to to do to deal with. Next email. I mean, we're 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 down to like the last six. Do you want to just like yeah. kind of put go. it to bed? Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Let's. No. Six. We have six left. Yeah. Let's fucking kill. Let's fucking plow through. Let's do it. Six. Jesus. We can make that. Hey, it's Jesse Chapman. It's okay to say my name. Mm-hmm. Just want to say you should bring back some of your old segments like Toppy and Left Wing Christian. Oh. Those bits are really funny. Huh? Maybe stay Maybe. tuned to what happened earlier. <laughs> yeah, that you've already heard. Yeah. All right. Uh, and I miss them. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Oh, uh, well. Thanks, Jesse. We're on it. On it. We like know. Bonnet. We know when, when, when we've got nothing. Just <laughs> bring out Toppy. <laughs> Or no. something like that. Okay. Break in case of emergency. All right, my email is <coughs> taking a while to load. Sorry. It's okay. Is it? <coughs> to me, not to Jackie. She's busy reading that book I got her for I'm Christmas. I'm not reading! And guess what? She didn't get me anything for Christmas. Next email. Okay. Hey, guys. It's Sarah Dees. Pronounced Dees. No. I was just curious. How was Hanukkah? I, I was sort of out of it. I didn't really do anything for Hanukkah. It was really cool. Yeah. I need advice. There's this annoying tall boy who won't leave me alone. He acts all depressed all the time, and he's 6'8", no exaggeration. Fuck him. How do I get him to leave me alone or hide from the sky? Can, can, can I give her some honest advice? Please. Don't say fuck him. No. Um, you have sex with him, and the motherfucker will leave you alone. Jackie, what's your advice? No, I swear to God. How ha- old is this girl? Have awkward sex with him. Say. How old and is she? And she's being bothered yeah. by a guy? Yeah. Fuck him, and he will leave you alone forever, especially if you're young. Justin... What? Get on mic if you're going to argue with me about this. I'm right. I don't know. I need to know how old she is because it's, maybe it's yeah, flirtatious it's games. Age, yeah, I have yeah. to write in and say how, Not enough tell me how details, old you are. Yeah. If, you're young, deets, deets. if you're young, and I'm not going to specify what age, but if you're younger, fuck him. He'll leave you alone. If you're in high school, like seriously, he will not look you in the eye. If you're older, eh, you might want to fucking like shit in front of him or fart in front of him, and then he'll leave you alone forever. All right. Next email, please. <laughs> okay. Uh, hey guys, I've been following your podcast since the beginning. I love your podcast. It has me laughing, and then everyone stares at me like, look at this asshole. Anyway, I've enclosed some really intense podcasts art you might want to consider. Wow. Anyway, Jackie, Ryan, and Justin, keep it up. You guys are awesome. Yeah. That's sweet. P.S. I once was a pig. Yours truly, Carlos Diaz. <laughs> yeah, and he cute. has some good art. email okay. art. Next email. Some of his art looks like, this first one looks like almost like a Don Martin piece from Mad Magazine, if anyone's familiar. <clears throat> Next email, please. Sanchez and on Ra- mic, Ryan. Sanchez Romero writes, what's up? Uh, cool. Uh, nothing. Uh, you guys should add Four Loco to your soundboard. Who's this? Sanchez Romero still? Four Loco. No, nope, that was Jade McWilliams. It was a guy named Jade, and it was sent. Oh, to the, to the, on, the, on the iPhone app. Gotcha. Which you can download on the iStore. What does it do? Uh, iPhone it's app got a little a soundboard. soundboard. You can hit it. plays a little sound bites like, so cute. Maybe. Oh, I want to hear it. Here, I don't actually it. know if so, so cute is it. You got it, Justin? Yeah, hold on. <clears throat> Here, I've got this. Got it. Oh, oh uh, yeah. Me, me, Here's me. It's a commercial me. for our for our, for our app. Me, so me, download me. it. So these are some of the things you can do. Got it. I'll send you care packages. I'm not even joking you. Spike TV shows boobs. Yeah. Naked oh. boobs. Oh, <laughs> whose turd is it? Let's take a massive chill pack. All right, whatever. There's a bunch of them. Hey, That's do it. great. Pitching this to the TV networks. Do one of me. <laughs> do one of me. Oh, uh, oh, you're not on there. I'm feeling very sensitive this week. <laughs> My job is secure. That was a mess. <laughs> <laughs> Castleberry! <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of them. Oh, 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 oh there's this one, too. I'm Toppy the Topic. Yeah. Okay. Well, they're coming and up they'll through a little be, quiet. They'll and... always be updated, I'm assuming. Well, there's... I mean, look, let's not promise anything. All right, but, you know. Well, we got to figure this shit out. But download the iPhone app. 
on the iStore. Let's search for Grandma's Virginity, and, and you'll you can find write it. Write emails directly to the show. Yeah, it, you, through the app, you can send emails directly to us and go to our We've already gotten Facebook page and blah blah blah. Okay, next email. <coughs> we okay. must be getting close. <clears throat> yeah. As I'm writing this, it's been about three weeks since the last GVP. I think you guys have done a decent job of updating the listenership through your Facebook page, explaining what's going on behind the scenes. But the other day, I read the following from a guy named Lance. You probably shouldn't have announced, this is a quote, you probably shouldn't have ever announced Friday as the release day. Also, you may want to consider releasing unedited podcasts. On mic, please. I suspect you're laboring over the editing process a bit much. You're never going to grow this show without some modicum modicum of regularity. (laughs) Was that real? That was awesome. Good job, Justin. (laughs) Keep going. That is not real. Uh, Chris goes on to say, to Lance, I say, with all due respect, eat a bag of dicks. Don't I'm a listener, mean. and I have completely. This is not me. This is Chris. I know, and I have but... completely different opinion. Please don't release raw audio. It usually sounds shitty. The volume levels can be all over the place, and there can be awkward pauses or behind-the-scenes chatter. A podcast isn't run like a radio show. I just think if you're going to step up and tell someone how to do their job, the least you could do is explain what makes you an expert. For whatever it's worth, my opinion comes from a guy I that produces like two podcasts. I don't like when our listeners are fighting. I know, Jaggy. I don't want to read this. It makes me sad. All right. Come well, on, listen, going. you guys, I understand what Lance is trying to say completely, 100%, and I understand what Chris is trying to say. They're both right. That's we need to be more regular and consistent. Way. We need regular to be... and consistent. Like but bowel movements. We need to be more regular like and consistent, BMs. but we can't compromise... Quality. Quality. Okay. Ryan, right. do you still have blood in your BMs? I'd love if the show was <laughs> was weekly or bi-weekly, but more importantly, please hey. just have fun with it and don't quit. People who live in glass houses don't throw stones, out, Burn out because, in my opinion, you're putting out one of the best shows available. All right. Next. Stevie writes, Hi, guys. It's Stevie. I missed you guys so much. I think this is the female Stevie. I've... I re-listened to all of your episodes a million times, but it was not the same. Not the lesbian, Stevie. No, not our friend. Jesus, Justin. I don't know. I really hope that Jackie and Justin make up because there would be no show without either of you. Love you guys. Uh, (laughs) No mention of you, Ryan. Uh, Well, because me and... No one... I wasn't fighting with anybody. Yeah. Yeah, It was you two. You feel... How do you feel about Justin this week, Jackie? Yeah, it's all right. (laughs) He got you a gift. Yeah, it was great. You ungrateful. Yeah, I already had it. It's so. fine. I got her something she already had. Yeah. It's my fault. It's only, I mean, I helped him score a lot of <laughs> points with his girlfriend, and then I got, I just got, like, a gift that I already got. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next email. Why didn't you get Jackie the lingerie and your girlfriend the World War II book? <laughs> oh, God, you're right. What was you, I thinking? You totally messed up. All right. Okay, last email of the week. Yo, last email, everybody. Hey, hey, GVP. I would love to produce the beat for a rap song by Psychic Abilities. Any chance you could record an acapella freestyle? Hmm. This could be Psychic Abilities' first hit single. I attach the basic beat. Do you think you could rap over the beat? If you can, yes. you should send me the, just the rap with no beat. Listen to the beat with headphones, and I can edit everything together, adding more layers. I know you're busy, so no rush. Hold on, let That's me see. awesome. Let me see if I can get this beat to play. Hold on. So he wants me to just what rap over rap over this beat? Yeah, as psychic abilities. Yeah, as psychic abilities. Yes, as psychic abilities. All right, I'll try. Ooh. All right. Yo, it's me, psychic abilities. I got abilities. I got abilities. Yo, I can tell the future. Yo, you got a question for me? I'll answer. Hey, yo, I'm a psychic abilities. I'm a just abilities, milling abilities. I've got my friend Nilbities. I'm a wizard of abilities. Yo, I'm a psychic abilities. Yo, I'm a tell about the future. Yo, one. Yo, hell yo. Yo, two. Hell yo. Yo, three. Hell yo. Four. Hell yo. Five, yo, to feel salvo. Yo, yo, salvo is not yo. Hey, yo, I'm psychic abilities, fool. You better rest the shoe. Yo, you better go to school. Yo, I'm a salvo. And then we'd need like a really hefty black guy to (laughs) jump in here and like actually do a real rap. And he'd be like, 
Yeah, my boy Psychic Abilities. He's coming straight from the, you know, but his raps would actually yeah, make sense and, and good. I thought that was pretty good. Yeah. And then Psychic Abilities would jump back in yeah. on the hook. And do what? And he'd be like, Yeah, yeah, let's be Psychic Abilities, yo. I got lots of abilities flow. Yo, I'm all of the I'm Psychic Abilities. I got the future, yo. What you want to know about? I'll tell you about all kinds of crazy stuff, yo. You lottery ticket? Uh, hell yeah! Uh, you love? Hell yeah! <laughs> All right. That was awesome. Yeah. So Beautiful. I don't know. You're well, gonna have a it's big a work in sale progress. on iTunes, I think. Yeah. It's a work in you progress. Hit. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good. Hey, but listen, Lance, that's a very good. Uh, beat. Just you know, basic basic ground level beat to rap over. I think a lot of that was mm-hmm. over modulated, but whatever. <laughs> All right, everybody. All right. Okay, that go. was you go, Jeff. Ryan. You go. Okay. okay, everybody. That was episode twenty-three. Yeah, Jackie's back. Everything's good. Justin and Jackie. Yep, everything's love each cool. Other. Go. What? And Jackie's, I think, warming up to me. What? Yeah. I don't know. So, anyways, listen. Um, that was episode, that was episode 23. twenty-three. Hope you guys get Hope all you guys your presents, get all the presents you were hoping for. Merry Christmas. Christmas, Merry Christmas, and oh. Happy Kwanzaa and everything else. And Merry Christmas, whatever and you happy believe, Hanukkah. whatever, whatever fucking, whatever crazy bullshit. Gets yeah, whatever, you for the night. whatever bullshit you believe in that keeps you fucking grounded, so you're not all worried about the fact that you're gonna die someday, like Tom Green. Yeah. Um. Uh, but, but listen, uh, Merry Christmas from the Grandma's Virginity Podcast. True, and uh, our present to you is the new iPhone, iPhone app. app. It's free. Download it. Enjoy it. Yeah, it's not perfect. <laughs> Maybe what someday is? it will be. But uh, you know, at but least neither it's is something. Justin's girlfriend's lingerie. It's got a, a no, no, no. It was pretty good. Oh, it was, yeah? it was I perfect. thought it had a big no, hole. She in looked it. perfect in it. under the in the crotch. Right? Yeah, no. There's a hole. There's a hole in there yeah. <laughs> somewhere. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Baby. Anyway, so um, I don't know uh, what else to say. Thanks uh, to I do. us, we're back. And I do. send me a present. I've got a couple Justin of things. Justin gave his PO box, yeah. box and I uh, want presents. A little bit of house cleaning here. Uh, Pigsarepeople.com. Check that out. That is our Facebook page. You can also just go to Facebook and search Grandma's Virginity. Join it. Like it. It, read on it. There's all kinds of shit going on there. It's the uh, the fifth member of the show. Um, <laughs> the fifth member? Well, whatever. I don't know. Okay. Um, also, uh, please send us emails. Grandmasvirginity at gmail.com. Please rate us on iTunes. Seriously, rate us on iTunes. And most importantly, go into forums and tell people about us. Go onto yeah. websites and like say, oh my god, have you heard about this? Don't make us do it. We, we're not doing it, and we won't. And we will freeze to. It's not cool. Yeah, it's not cool. It's not cool to talk about your own fucking Spread shit. Spread the word grassroots style. You people do it. Yeah. If you've got a TV show on the air and you're a fan of our show, you know, slip some if shit into your show. If you're a celebrity, yeah, do references to us. We've got a lot of fans that have TV shows <laughs> if you're a, on the air. Hey, if you're a celebrity of the show, write us and say, eh, well, I'll be a guest. Yeah. Hey, I'm, uh... We want, we want any... If, if hey, you are, it's me, uh... If you have fans... Bobby... Come be a guest. Who's Bobby? Who's a famous Nero. person in Bobby? Bobby De Niro. If you're, from, if you're yeah. from Norway or France, like anywhere in Europe, please write Eat in. I want to go on a trip. <laughs> I want to go on a trip. All right. So and uh, coming to your town soon, a live Grimace for Disney podcast, right, guys? Uh, so. Maybe, right, maybe, we'll maybe, maybe, show. maybe when hell freezes over. All right. I mean, Jesus, we'll go I got a life. We'll do a li- It'll be fun. We'll do a live show okay, in LA okay. first, and right, we'll fine, move on. Fine, fine, fine. Okay. All right, everybody. Uh, that was episode twenty. Three, thank you so much, and we'll see you in the Happy new year. Happy holidays! Bye. Bye. Well, that was a Merry Christmas episode, now wasn't it? Don't forget to email your gifts in the forms of voicemail, fan art, songs, and other garbage. Send it to Grandma's Virginity at gmail.com. Rate us on iTunes, you jack off. What's wrong with you? Get in the game over at bigsarepeople.com. Hurry up! I'm your announcer, Smith Harrison. Thanks for listening this year. Thanks be to God, Jesus, and Moses on this holiest of days. Merry Christmas. 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 Merry Christmas, 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 Merry Christmas.
In my early years, I would never see anyone so free as Mark, Jake, Ryan, Ridley taking over airwaves, sending from USA, talking to Mary on Mr. Skips, always having fun. And Buscarino is a pretty voice And Ryan has a pretty face according to himself And Justin is depressed but so funny in his voice I have to laugh and have no choice but to smile My three friends in California, many miles from me. So, grandmother's virginity, please stay on the air for me.